Welcome back everyone, hope you're all doing well. Today we are going to continue our Minecraft playthrough, so let's get started. Just load in here. Alright. Okay, we had our bed moved over here because we couldn't sleep over there. Alright. Let's see, where are we at? Um, we made the elevators last time we played. Should probably make this look nicer. Uh, we also made a little rail system to get down there. We got villagers up here now. Or outside. It's like a little villager area. And let's see, how many diamonds do we have? We've got 22, so maybe we should look for some more diamonds today. Okay, we got this stuff. We can deposit that. Uh, Gunpowder. Gold nuggets. Let's put all these blocks in here. Oh yeah, we also found like a fortress in the nether too, so we can check that out today as well. Um, I probably want to enchant my gear a little bit more though. Because where are we at? Yeah, I'm thinking maybe... Wait, wasn't it the... um Our legs... I think we were going to chant the legs next, because it had protection on it. Yeah, so the legs are the next one. We just have to get to level 30 for that. Okay. And let's go... Actually, let's go check on the animals. We got wheat. Okay. How about seeds? No seeds. Okay. Okay. Let's go check on them really quick. Cool, we got a little iron golem there. So I looked up how to um, like do an automation with the farm. I don't know, man. Seems like a lot of work. <laughs> I feel like I'm just gonna have these guys here and um, they're just gonna be like consistently feeding each other, making more. I can make more beds here. And then get some like other more specialized villagers potentially. We could try to do that. But yeah, it looks like this is still still has to grow. So let's go check out the cows. Oh my god. Look at that, they're like like glitching. There's so many of them. Let's get these numbers down a bit. Come on, guys. I don't want to step in there and die. Double check, no creepers? No creepers. Funnel in right here. Yeah, I think feeding them gives you more XP. Yeah, let's just grab all this stuff right now. Cool. Wow, we've got a lot of leather from that. Let's go feed these guys now. Yeah, look at that XP just jump. Alright, disperse, disperse. No more. Come forward. Come forth, receive your hay. Over here. I think that's all we're going to get right now. I feel like I want to grab some sheep too. We have the one. Hmm. Oh yeah, we have this jungle tree growing as well. I'm hoping to get like four saplings out of the, out of the leaves. So we'll see. 
That would be nice, though. This guy just chilling in the water, of course. I do know how to fix this now. We'll get around to that eventually, though. Okay. Let's go back in. Cook some of this meat, too. Okay, I don't know where that zombie is. Okay, he's gonna dump that in there, dump this in there. And why not? Okay, bunch of eggs that we do not need right now. Toss those in there. Perfect. All right. Let's put the wheat away. What else we got? Where were we storing the leather? Was it in here? Yeah, we got leather in here. All right. Leather and feathers. All right. So we still need one and a half more levels before we can actually enchant our pants. And then after that, I want to get like some kind of fire enchant too. Like fire protection when we go in there. I feel like that'd be good to have. Okay. So in the meantime... We're waiting for the crops to grow so we can get more XP. How about we do some mining? Yeah, we have an extra iron pickaxe. That's fine. All right, let's see if we can find some diamonds. And I get to show you guys my little um, track that I made. It saves us a little time, I think. Nothing too crazy, but you know. And there's our stop. Cool. Maybe I will make a, uh, another track this way, too. I've thought about it. We just need the materials first, though. That's, like, the main thing. Let's swap that out. This will be our, like, default pickaxe, and then when we find ores and stuff, we'll use this with the fortune on it. Yeah, so that little area that we just passed by. That's where the, um, I forgot what it's called, that dark place. And it summons like the warden too. That's what that is. Okay, we still have 23 stakes. Got 32 torches, we're good. Yeah, we got quite a distance this way. This would be pretty nice to have a track just automatically taking us over here. Yeah, see? Got the little sensors here again, too. You can hear them. Let's just hope they don't spawn anything. Ooh, look at that. Lucky, lucky. Diamonds right away. Okay. There's gotta be more. Gotta be more than that, right? Right? I guess not. Ah, oh, just two. That's kind of lame. Okay, place that there. Eat that. And we're going to do a little strategy again. We just dig this out. Okay, that's nothing. Oh, deep dark. That's what it's called. Deep dark. Oh. Yeah, this is actually a really good technique for like finding stuff. Very nice. This is a big one right here. Sweet. Okay, we're already up to 16 diamonds. That's good. Alright. Here we go again. Wait, what? Yeah, we're going this way. I don't know why I just got confused. Oh yeah, because the um we we're looking for diamonds in this spot. Okay, I remember. Mm 
Mm, wait. Oh, I thought that was iron. Never mind. I would be happy to find some more gold and iron, though, too. So we can add some rails down here. We'll just have that little transfer station, like between going up and then going this direction. Oh, we got gravel. Alright, nothing there. I can hear lava. Same strategy. I hate these. I'm actually curious if there's anything in this like whole gravel area. Maybe there's a cave here. Hmm. It looks like there might be. Hold up. Some deep dark right there. Oh, we got some diamonds. Oh, some redstone too. Yeah, why not? This gives us XP. But let's get the diamonds first so we don't forget. Nice. And you know what? For good measure, let's dig out a little bit around here. Just in case there's some hidden ones. Okay, no. I think we're good. There's nothing there. Oh, shoot. I should have made another pickaxe. Oh, well. Cool. Some more redstone. And you know what? I'm going to build a bridge across here because I will definitely fall down there. That's something that would happen to me. Okay. Oh, some iron right there. Mm. <laughs> I don't know if that's worth the risk. Let's go exploring a little bit. Oh, there's a sensor right there. Yeah, let's not go over there. It's over here, though. Oh, some more redstone. That looks very precarious to get, though, so... Let's not. I want to dig this out though, because we do need um, we do need flint for arrows. Maybe we'll uncover something. And then we can always like gather this stuff and then you know do that little flint trick, or just build like a tower of gravel, and keep digging down. Like the sound. Oh my god! Go away! Go away! Okay, maybe that's enough. We don't want to like break our shovel. And back this way. Right? Yeah, we were over here. Okay. Perfect. Let's do this. But we know this is like a way to go. There's that torch there. All right. And that gave us 12 flint. That's not bad. Yo, how's it going, Zared? Uh, pretty good, man. We got a decent amount of diamonds now. I got an elevator, too. We got a little rail system. We got villagers outside, too. We got a lot of stuff. I did die, though, and I lost my really good pickaxe enchant. So, this is what we have right now. It was better, but... 
That was decent. But yeah, we got full diamond gear. Working on getting the rest of it enchanted right now. I found a fortress in the nether. But yeah, I'm waiting to get all the enchantments first before I go exploring that. Okay, nothing over there. I love this technique though, man. This is so good. Uh oh, I hear more lava. Very helpful to mine properly. Yeah, for real, dude. Otherwise, that would just be kind of, I don't know, just digging a line. <laughs> like straight across. Okay, hopefully this doesn't spawn anything. Last time we came across the place like this, there was a warden that spawned and it kind of wrecked us. Okay, we got lava. I'm gonna build across. I think we're okay. Let's do this though, I don't wanna like risk it, you know? These things are so creepy. Oh yeah, those gives XP too. Because yeah, we're working on getting level 30 again too, so we can enchant our legs. Oh god, yeah, we gotta go back soon. I think we have a decent amount of iron, I can't remember. We may have to go looking for just iron again. We'll see when we get back. Lots of gravel here. Okay, let's do this again. Dig out the side. At least until this breaks. Get out of here. Oh, that's cool. I like how the XP actually, like, travels to you. You don't have to go pick it up. Okay. This is just about to break. There you go. Alright, let's go back. This time we'll make at least, like, three iron pickaxes before we come back down here. Okay, we came... We got 17 diamonds, 26 redstone, 13 flint. That's pretty decent. Now the thing is, I don't know if I want to keep continuing in digging like this direction, or should I branch out a different direction to like save time from walking back? Maybe I will do that. Yeah. That'd probably be smart. Because eventually this is going to take so long just to like get back to our little minecart, <laughs> just going this direction. But we know that we have a little deep dark area here that we can spawn a warden at just in case we need to like farm him for whatever reason I don't know like the best way to kill him or anything but yeah I don't know <laughs> we'll figure it out okay there we go so maybe not this direction but we could like dig out that direction okay let's go back so we've got a little roller coaster ride back to our base very slow, but, you know, I don't have to press W. Come on. You can make it. Go. Push. It's definitely not optimal, but, you know. Well, it is fast on the way down. And we're home. Redstone. We've got 39 diamonds now. Got our flint. What was in here? Oh, we still have some rails. Oh, yeah, we still have a lot of rails, actually. And the thing we need is um, gold bars for the other ones. Oh, we still have blocks of gold, too, actually. We could break these down. Right? Yeah, nine bars. Oh, my God. 
<laughs> That's so much. Yeah, why not do that? Alright. So we probably could actually make another rail system over there if we wanted. But I think I'm going to dig out the other way first. See if we can find anything cool. Okay, we got... We need torches, actually. Let's grab some torches. There we go. Perfect. Oh, yeah. And pickaxes. Oh, yeah. We have almost three stacks of iron. We're good. We don't need to farm any more iron. Okay, let's grab some of these planks here. Uh, let's just... Let's do that. Put the rest away. Tough gravel. Lots of gravel. I'm not sure why I'm holding this boat, but maybe we'll need it. Oh, I should bring like a water bucket with me. I feel like that's something that's always handy to have. Could have swore I had another one. I must have lost it or something. Oh well, we can fill this up with water. Anyway. Let's do this. Let's make three of those. Okay, three pickaxes, and let's make a backup shovel. Boom. All right. Put the iron away. Okay. Is it nighttime? No, it's raining. I could show you my show you my elevator. Here's the uh, going down one. It's a lot of useless copper. Yeah, I don't know what else to do with the copper. I have no idea. It's just kind of chill in there. Maybe I could do some like decorating with it. Can I grab from this? I can. Okay. So this is like another work in progress too. I want to make this look nicer. I'll probably make the ceiling taller. And like maybe push this out a little bit farther further back. Make this deeper. But here's like the start of our elevator. I like this part the most. The going up part. Alright. Got our water bucket. Oh yeah, is this going to give us a level? No, not yet. It's a lot of steak though. Yeah, we got our food chest. Let's drop that in there. You know what? Let's split that up. We don't want to carry all of it. Okay, also, let's check on our farm over here. Let's see if the wheat's grown. Because we might have enough for another level. Not yet. The farmers are doing their thing, though. Okay, let's go back in the mines. But let's dig straight across this time. Here we go. Here comes the speed. Come on. Come on. Come on. Slowly. Slowly. And... Boom. Yeah, actually, if I do keep continuing going forward, I could just make this like a stop up ahead, and then we can develop or just like build some kind of like pass through here, so we can keep going straight ahead. Yeah, that's something we can do. But if we do that, I have to do something like this. Right? So then that would be a track. But then we need to clear this out. Alright, there we go. Now we can keep going this way. And it'll be a little bit less time to get back to uh, our little minecart here. Alright. Let's do it. Start right here. And we are currently at... Negative 53? I think that's the same level as here. Yeah, same level.
torch. I feel like we should do something with the tracks too. Like not just have something going into the mine, but maybe for like traveling. But we can utilize like being underground for it though. I just don't know what. Maybe if we find like something outside that's like worth traveling to, we can do that. I don't know what that would be because we don't really need the village anymore because we have our own villagers. Got a nether portal. Maybe a swamp. Well, that's kind of far though. Because we did find a swamp that has like a slime spawn location, I guess. Hold up. Let's keep it consistent. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of a journey though. If we do that, I think we just go the direction we were going at first, like to this way. Because what is that? Isn't that east? Oh, it's west. Yeah, that sounds right. I think it's to the west. Like, that's where the, um, the swamp is. Pretty sure. Slimes are important if you want to make complex machinery. Yeah. I'm gonna have to, like, look that up. But I know there's, like, some kind of, like, pistons you can make and stuff. Like, there's so much, like, machinery stuff you can make in this game. Like, I initially wanted to make an automated farm for, like, the wheat. But I don't know. It seemed kind of difficult. But Toshi was saying there's a way that you can do it with just, like, rails underneath. People have made computers in the game. I saw that, yeah. <laughs> Crazy stuff with redstone. Oh, hey, Toshi. How you doing, man? We were just talking about you. Like that brief second ago. <laughs> doing good, man. Thanks for asking. How you doing? Yeah, we were saying how... um. You were telling me about how there's a way to automate the wheat, like the wheat farm. And you put like rails underneath and hoppers. I looked up videos on um, YouTube, how to do like an automated farm, but they didn't show any of that strategy. So I don't know. I think I'm going to hold off on that until I find like the strategy with the rails. Because all the other ones seem kind of complicated. Yeah, they do like... I don't know. We always just used a piston and floodgates. Oh yeah, I saw that too. Like the water is supposed to... Like it harvests the crops for you. And then they just like float down into a chest. We could do that actually. But I wanted it like to... like. I wanted the villagers to plant for me. You know? So I don't have to do it either. But yeah, we could figure something out. Am I a pro Minecrafter? You're pretty good at Minecraft. Yeah, I know the farmer can plant for me. They've been doing it right now. It's just, they're not like putting the wheat in the chests or the seeds in the chest. That's kind of what I wish they would do, but it's okay. Because the main reason I want all that is for like the animal experience. But now that I'm thinking about it, I don't... Oh, there's gold. Nice. I don't think they would drop the seeds, huh? They would probably keep the seeds from, like, harvesting. Because that's, like, the easiest one. Easier than um, the cows is having the seeds and feeding the chickens for XP. Yeah, <laughs> industrial craft. <laughs> I know there's, like, a ton of mods for this, too. It's pretty cool. But I mean, I want to actually like finish, if you can finish, uh, finish vanilla before I go into like the mods or anything. 
Because I know there's like a lot of really cool ones. I remember one that I saw. It was kind of like a space age sort of one. I think the goal was to like build a rocket. But they had like this hard drive kind of thing. And it was like infinite storage and one little thing. That one was pretty cool. I always like to play the one called The Beast. We had nuclear power. The Beast. I haven't heard of that one. That sounds cool though. Nuclear power. <laughs> I would love to build like like hydropower, like have a, a stream or a river or something, then have like one of those wheels turning, like generating power through that. That seems like it'd be pretty cool. Oh, that's industrial craft? Oh, okay, so they do have something like that. I don't know if I've seen that one or not. I, I can't remember what the space one's called. Hydro and wind. Oh yeah, wind too. You can get some windmills going. Nice. I feel like I should learn how to make like those automated farms first though, before I get into that stuff. It's easier than I thought. It needs less rails and stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, the one I saw... When I looked it up, they had a villager in the center, and it was like, okay, the farmers would farm, and then you know how they throw potatoes at each other? They would throw potatoes at the villager, but it wouldn't quite reach, and I guess that would go into the hoppers and into the chests. I think that's how that worked. Then there's like multiple types of power, like electric as well as hydraulic. Yeah, that sounds pretty sick. Is there like a, um, do they have different bosses too? The villagers have to be fed. Yeah. They always like toss potatoes back and forth. Oh, not usually? Okay. Because I'm like wondering, is there like a different end goal for those kind of ones? Because the one that I was thinking of with the unlimited storage, the goal was to like make a rocket. And I guess like go to the moon or something? I can't remember. I just like briefly saw someone play it. There's this thing called a quarry. Did you visit? No, I haven't visited the ancient city yet. I don't know where exactly it is because I burned down that outpost. <laughs> I don't know how to find that anymore. But it's okay. I did find the place where a warden spawns. But is it worth going to the ancient city? Do I like... Is there something that I absolutely need from there? You get a disc? Ah, uh, okay. I mean... Oh, lots of diamonds? Hmm. We don't have a music player, though. I don't know how you get that. I don't think I've found any discs yet. And a compass that points to your last day. Oh, man. I knew where I died last time, in the nether. What's over here? Oh, hey! We've been here. That's kind of weird. I'm so... Wait, what? I don't remember where that leads, but okay. <laughs> You know what? I'm also going to block this off. I'm so, like, accident prone. There we go. With the echo shards? Oh, yeah. I don't know if I'm going to need that compass or not. Because I'm pretty good about, like, remembering where I die. If I do die. <gasps> Ooh, diamonds. I don't die too often. So you need it because you're in here. I'm not that bad. <laughs> Look at me, man. I got 11 diamonds already. 
Wait. Okay, yeah, I've been turned around here. Back to this way. Oh, sweet, I didn't notice. We're level 30 already. Okay, perfect. So next time we go back up, we're gonna go enchant our pants. It's Black Friday week. Yeah, I still gotta do Christmas shopping, man. I haven't gotten anyone any gifts yet. I was waiting for um, Black Friday and Cyber Monday. Pant enchant. Yeah, I gotta enchant my pants, bro. <laughs> The skulk gives you more XP? What's the skulk? I don't know if I've seen that yet. The shiny things. Huh? Oh, you mean this stuff. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. That's a decent amount. Little bits. Oh yeah, that is, that's actually a pretty decent amount. Extremely fast with the hoe. Let's see. Oh, dang, wow, okay. <laughs> oh. We're farming this stuff. I don't know what else we do with it, though, but it's giving us XP. Going all out. We've got some redstone here. Can't do anything else. Is, so that's basically it. Oh, we're not even harvesting it. It's just kind of like breaking. Yo, that's some nice XP though. Hold on, let's go see what's over here. Just out of curiosity. Okay, it looks like there's a lot of this stuff here. There's a block. When mobs die around it, it spawns skulk. Is that in the deep dark? You're angry in their god, though. It's okay. As long as, like, a warden doesn't spawn, we're good. Break it all! This is crazy. <laughs> it's like raining experience. I'm going all out right now. Oh! Unless you saw a thing with bone antenna, it's fine. Yeah, I've seen that. Um, we actually got into that little warden area before. So I know where that is in case we do need to kill a warden for whatever reason. I'm not sure why we would need to, though, but we... I know where the spawn is. Okay, level 32? Not bad. You can insta-break those things and stop the warden from spawning? Yeah, I broke the one nearby, but I left one, like, further away, just in case we want to, like, kill him for whatever. Like, maybe we get an achievement or something? I don't know. Okay, let's go back really quick. Because, yeah... We need to enchant these pants. Oh, there's not, no achievement or anything? Aw. Wait, what? Did I go the wrong way? Huh? Oh, this might have been that offshoot that we found. Fire protection 4. Should I get that over regular protection 4? Because I was thinking of getting fire protection on something. But I have um, protection available. Oh my god! Come back. You want both? I have um, regular protection on this. Yeah. I was thinking of getting fire protection for when we go into the nether, though. Because there's those things that shoot fire. Because we found a fortress last time in the nether. And I do want to explore that. didn't did my boat things oh yeah weren't you saying that if you put a boat in the minecart you go faster i forgot about that i do have a boat 
We can test that out. Dude, I love that little track. That's so nice. Alright, we're up to 50 diamonds. Look at all that redstone. We got raw gold. Let's toss that in the furnace. Put it in this one. Alright, enchantments. I mean, we do have enough um, diamonds. We could make like another set just with fire protection, right? Oh wait, that's not what I want to do. Diamond leggings. Yeah, see, protection four. And unbreaking. Okay. Alright, so... What are the boots going to give us? You can hear like the baby villager. Maybe I can get fire protection on the boots. Put mending on. What would I put that on? The pickaxe? Sharpness. Oh yeah, we wanted sharpness with the sword, I remember. But I think it goes up to sharpness five, right? So I don't want to use that just yet. What does the helmet give us? Blast protection, there's fire protection. Okay, we might be re-rolling this. You have an extremely high amount of free XP nearby. Where? The villagers? They're just chilling. They're probably like behind this wall, honestly. Okay. What else do we have? There's a fishing pole. Oh, the skulk? Yeah, that's true. That is very true. Yeah, we might make another... I don't know. Hmm. I feel like we might want a combination of fire protection and just regular protection when we go into the nether. Like, not just one. Oh, yeah. Put the mending on a diamond hoe. And infinite XP. Oh, that's a good point, yeah. Well, we got mending on this fishing rod. <laughs> oh, that doesn't really do us any good, though. Oh, yeah, that's another thing. I was trying to get um, luck of the sea on a fishing rod. So why don't we make a fishing rod? I'm actually not sure if it's even worth it at this point now. But, I mean, we can try it. How do you make it again? Is this the fishing rod? I don't have a mending villager yet, no. Oh, I was close. <laughs> close enough. Okay, put the string back. Speaking of the villagers, I should put like a little lectern over there. So we get a um, closer villager. Instead of going to that other village. Unbreaking. Uh, so I think I'm just going to re-roll this then. breaking again. I have so many books here. Do I have a mending in here? Protection, power, knockback, silk touch. I have silk touch. Yeah, go ahead, Toshi. Have you ever heard of Andrew Tate? I've heard of him. And I know there's like a lot of controversy, but I didn't care enough to like look him up. I don't really care about that stuff, to be honest. Like, I don't, I don't even follow celebrities, really. I'm just like, eh. They're just people, man. Who cares? You should have two pickaxes, fortune and silk touch. Silk touch. That's where it saves blocks, right? So I know you could use that for ice, but what else would you need that for? Lure two. I think luck of the sea is better, though, right? Mushroom biome and glass and other stuff. Okay. Hmm. For grass. 
I guess we could work on that. We could find like another diamond pickaxe. I should probably try to get mending on this though, huh? For leaves. Would that be like the same outcome as shears with leaves? Leaves you have shears. Okay, yeah. I want... I want to upgrade this. I want sharpness on this. I think that's what we're going to work towards next. Wait, did we check the boots? Check the boots. Unbreaking. Nah, we don't want that. Okay, let's re-roll. We got knockback. Okay. Unbreaking again. Knockback. Thought silk touch work too. It probably does, yeah. Enchant two swords. What would I put on the other one? I guess looting, right? Sharpness 3 plus 3 equals sharpness 4. Oh, you can't enchant sharpness 4. You have to combine them? Oh, dude, if that's the case, I think I skipped over one. I swear I saw another, like, enchantment. Okay. What was that again? Unbreaking. Oh, fishing rod 2. We can check the fishing rod. Lore 3. Yeah, I think we want luck of the sea. You can, but that's rare. Okay, that's good to know. Alright, let's re-roll this. Protection 1. Okay, what do we got now? Knockback. No. Unbreaking 3. Unbreaking 3. Oh my god. Why? Here goes all my XP. Wait, that's the wrong spot. Stop wasting your XP. How else do you re-roll this? Is there another way to re-roll? Feather falling. Re-go on level 30. Retry after. Will the enchantments change? Because I've been doing this to re-roll until I get a good one and then just coming back. See, look, we got sharpness 3 on this one now. So if we come back, we make another sword and get sharpness 3, we can combine them. So just we need to get to level 30 now again, and then we can enchant this. Because that's what I've been doing. Okay. So we can come back for that. Go get some skulk to refill. True, we do have some areas. Okay. We need five more levels. Oh yeah, before that though. I want to bring this lectern over there to the villagers. Where's it at? Over here? Almost nighttime. Wait, I thought we had one. Wait, what? Where'd this cat come from? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I guess we can make another lectern over there. Let's go to sleep. The villagers spawn them? Oh, okay. So they must be, like, right behind this wall or something then. Okay, I'm gonna make another lectern, I think. And just bring that over there really quick. So we have a, um, a librarian nearby. Okay, bookshelf, oak slabs. How do you make bookshelf? It's like... Why is that not working? There we go. Books. Books require... Okay, leather and paper. Leather, paper. And we need three books. One, two, three. Okay. Put that back. Put that back. And... Planks. Wait, how many of those do we need? Okay, we just need one. So let's grab some planks. Okay, we got the bookshelf. Now we need slabs, I think. Four slabs. Yeah, we got birch. You don't like birch? I like birch. Okay. 
<laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> I like the birch and I like the um that redwood. I don't know what it's called. The redwood looks really nice. Okay, we got a lectern. Let's go over here really quick. Minecraft community usually hates that. Well, you know what? They have bad taste. Oh, yeah, I think it's acacia. Yeah. Yeah, that's the one. That one looks really nice, in my opinion. The acacia. All right. Mangrove is redder. I don't think I've seen the mangrove one. I'm just going to put that right there. Are we going to need a librarian? Is anyone free? I don't know if anyone's free yet. Oh well, it's there if someone wants to convert. We have five available beds. Three farmers. Break a composter. Eh, it's okay, they'll make some more villagers. We just have that in the meantime. Okay. Let's go back, get that XP. Oh yeah, we have a horse now too. Eventually need to make something look better than that though. <laughs> that's just like a... Oh, that's where they went. Why are they... You guys. That's where they went. <sighs> Hot tub stream. I don't know why they're in there. Like, come on guys. Get with the program here. Alright, anyway. Let's make another hoe. I gotta fix that water too, eventually. I know how to fix it now, but it's gonna take a bit. Okay. Put this stuff away. And we're gonna make a hoe. We got our sticks, and boom. Okay, let's try out this boat thing. Huh? I don't get it. <laughs> Is that right? I can't put the boat in the cart. Whatever, let's just go in. Push. Push the boat with the minecart, maybe? Huh? Oh! Well, <laughs> there goes that. Well, we can try it again, though. No! Come back! Okay, well, we can dig this out. It is pretty fast, yeah. You got a point there. Uh, This looks kind of sketchy, actually. I'm going to leave that. The real test will be going up. We'll see how it is when we go up. This right here, though, we can probably dig this out and be fine. Wait, what? There was a catalyst up there? Oh, you mean for, um, the warden? Hold on, I'll go back. In here, right? Oh, you mean this thing right here? That one, right? Thing that spawns the skull? That spawns it, right? Yeah, I've seen those. Yeah, we have a... Don't break it. Yeah, I'm not gonna break it. That also spawns the warden, right? I'm pretty sure that spawns the warden. 
Because we have one in this other area. Unless you have Silk Touch. No? You're kidding me. <sighs> Goodbye. Here, I'll show you. So we have one over here. There's two things. So there's one that spawns a warden, and then one that spawns a, um... Oh, the Shrieker. Here, we have it over here. I broke the one nearby, but there's one still over here. See, like, right over there, and... Where's it at? It's, like, somewhere over here. there's like one up there that that did it those aren't because they would have spawned the warden because you activated the sensor I think there's one up here or was it over there might be over there. Yeah, see right there. I think that's the spawner, right? Because it has the, um, the four little pillars on it. Yeah, I left that there just in case. Yeah, I don't want to spawn it. I just wanted to show you. Like, we have one over here just in case we wanted to spawn one. But yeah, no, that's scary. <laughs> Because then it gets all dark. I can't find my way back. This area is huge, though. Got a little archer up there. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Let's get out of here. <laughs> but we have this place. We can come back here anytime. Those catalysts give you more XP when broken. Yeah, I'm not going to farm this area out. Just I'm going to leave it like that. Anyway, we'll continue where we were at. Such a long journey back. Oh, and then we have like a geode in this direction too, which is cool. Haven't like dug further that way though. Oh my god. Come on. There we go. And we still have one backup pickaxe. Okay. Yeah. We're just going to leave that there. Keep going this way. For now. I think next time we go up, I should probably look for more sheep. Get some wool. Don't you want to refill your XP? I do. I'm hoping we find like a bigger area. Like a bigger area with all that stuff. But I mean, this gives us XP too. Like this redstone. Okay, let's um Let's do that. can place a torch every 13 blocks or 14. Yeah, I know they changed the lighting, but um, I kind of like this method. Like you just mine out like five or whatever, place a torch, just keep doing that. It's like easier for me to count. And I mean, coal's like not super rare or anything. I need the light. <laughs> Space of 26 blocks between each. See, that seems, that seems like too much. I like it like this. You can stand in one spot, mine out, place a torch, and that's pretty much it. And you just keep doing that over and over.
I haven't had music in a while, man. Where'd the music go? I need to bring, like, a jukebox with me once we find it. Have a portable music player. <laughs> it's like, alright, we're gonna dig here for a bit. Let me place it down. Put in a CD. Yeah, that's another thing that we can tunnel to. It was kind of the same direction as the swamp, but there's like a, um, there's an underwater temple that we found. I was thinking of maybe... Some like weird sound, but I was thinking maybe like we tunnel into it instead of like trying to swim into it. Like we get underneath and like dig up. I don't know if that would work or not though. Because there's those fish that curse you, and it, like, makes it impossible to mine. So, yeah, I don't know. Oh, we got gold. Very nice. Maybe we will make some more rails soon. Okay, nothing over there. We'll just go until this iron pickaxe breaks, and then we'll go back up and probably go look for sheep. Because I want to make that little villager house kind of like a bunker, I guess. We need more beds in there. Oh, more gold! Puts us at 34 gold already. Wow. Okay. one of those dark places uh, it's XP right now it sucks that the gold doesn't give you XP like, same with the iron too I don't think those like either of those give you XP but I guess you get it from smelting them right just don't get it from mining half durability left. Also, when it's nighttime again, too, we should probably go out. Well, that's probably after we get our sword enchant. But we should definitely go out and, like, kill some monsters for more XP, too. 
And the drops, of course. Oh, we got more gold. A lot of gold in this direction, actually. us at 54 now. Wow. some gravel finally. Just break through that. Okay, switch back. I think we're still good on arrows. Yeah, 44 arrows. We can dig this out though, actually. Gravel's easy to, like, break. We may even find something behind it all, too. So much. So much gravel. Okay, I'm not seeing anything, though. Just lots of gravel. Endless gravel. Well, we got flint for days now, though. Okay, forget it. <laughs> we can always come back here for more. We know where this is. way. Cool, more redstone. We have a lot of this already. We kind of have an abundance of redstone right now. I'm not sure if we actually need to like farm it anymore, but I guess that's XP. We could probably use it for decoration too eventually. Make some redstone blocks, you know? Okay. Let's keep going. Okay, can we keep digging this way now? Is all the gravel gone? Yeah, okay, perfect. All right, we got a few more blocks to go till this breaks. Redstone blocks can be a bit of a flex. Oh, really? Okay, maybe I shouldn't do that then. <laughs> I'm trying to think of some like cool decorative blocks we can use eventually. Flex is good. Yeah, I guess so. We could make like different room themes. Okay, pickaxe, pickaxe is broken. Like maybe we can make the library out of wood or something. Make our chest room out of redstone, stuff like that. I don't like this lava here. Why does that look so weird? Let's mine some of this out. Sounds like it's hissing. Okay, I don't think those give you XP. Diamond block is the ultra flex. I don't think I'm going to go diamond block. <laughs> That's a bit much. Yeah, they do sound mad. 
It's like the blocks are alive and they're hissing at me. Oh. Put that back. Okay. Careful now. Oh, I hear a sensor. Oh yeah, I love this XP right now. This is so good. Okay, let's go back. I think we were going this way. Pretty sure. Yeah, there we go. We just don't have our card anymore because it flew up here. <laughs> you know what? This area is a little... It's better to mine out. This area is kind of weird, though. What is over here? Is this just a dead end? Yeah, dead end. Love it. Oh, we uncovered some gold. Nice. Working up a hunger, man. All this harvesting. Alright, we're done. <laughs> I'm missing the minecart. This does feel slower. But maybe it's because I'm holding W. It's nice not having to hold it. Okay, we're back. I don't want this in here anymore. <laughs> Let's do just the minecart so that doesn't happen again. Oh, here it is. It's like, where did it go? All right, lots of redstone again. Let's go check on our little gold situation here. There we go. Chicken. More meat. Okay. Let's bring the shears with us. Where are the shears? There they are. We've got one wool block. Okay. We've got one bed. Let's bring the bed with us in case we need to sleep. Gravel. More of that. Some more flint. I think we're putting it in here. Let's take this one out. Boom. 56 flint. Oh yeah, we should make a hoe. go and another backup pickaxe actually maybe three more again just to have them we got the iron and you know what <laughs> let's do a backup pair of shears too I don't remember the recipe for that though okay just two iron Alright, looking good. I think we're ready. Let's look outside. Still have some daylight. These chickens right now. Okay. So I wanted the, um, the hoe, 
so we can grab some carrots and maybe bring a sheep over here or a few sheep. Just do that. Okay, I think there are sheep in this direction. Pretty sure. I just don't know how far. Is that a sheep? No, I think that's snow. there with a village or not because there is this village here everyone got wiped out though i don't know how oh and there's a spider spawner here too i wish it was something else but at least we have a spawner i just don't know what to do with it though Okay, no sheep over here yet. I think I see some pigs over there. It's not what we're after though. More pigs. Pigs up there. More pigs. Where's the sheep, man? I need wool. Ugh, so many mountains, dude. So much jumping. It's the only downside of this. Ugh, come on. <laughs> yeah, there's like a little clearing where it opens up over here. I think that's where the sheep are. If we can just get like two, that'd be perfect. We have one that's like chilling with the chickens, but it's like trying to get that out. Okay, here's one. There's one right there. Is there any others though? I thought we had more over here. I see him. We got sheep. Got one right there, too. Let's go shear them first, though. Oh, shoot. Whoops. <laughs> I just hit it with the shears. Whoa. Oh, that could have been bad. Look before you leap. All right, looks like it's about to turn nighttime almost. Get over here, come back. Okay, good thing we have a bed. That's 10 wool right there too, very nice. Let's just sleep here, out in the open. It's fine. Did you grow back already? Must be a different sheep. Alright guys, I got carrots. Don't you want the carrots? Yeah. Hey, come on. Is it not carrots? Oh, dude. Wait, is it wheat? It might be wheat. No! I think it is wheat. Oh, shoot. Oh, well, you know what? We got some wool. We can make more beds with what we have. We got 13. I'm gonna grab this one over here, too. Actually, there's two of them. 
And we don't have a pen for them either, so we can make a pen. Had to AFK what I miss. Um, I was using carrots to try to bait the sheep, but I think it's actually wheat that we need. That's like the main thing. Because <laughs> I was trying to bring some sheep over, but yeah, they don't, they're not responding to the carrots. Unfortunately. Get over here. But anyway, we have a decent amount of wool from these guys now. We've got 18. Yeah, we can make a few beds. It's like six more beds right there. Yeah, we can always come back here. It's not too far. I'm gonna bring my sword out. Because, yeah, we need to make some more beds for the villagers because they just keep getting trapped in that little water area. I don't know how to get them out. Maybe if I fix it, that would work. I don't know. I feel like eventually we're going to want these bees, too. I should have brought the horse here, actually. I'm wondering if we can, like, hold wheat while we're on a horse. Then, like, bring the, uh, the sheep with us that way. That I'm not sure of. I would hate to bring it all the way out here and not be able to do that, though. Yeah, the spawner is right in there. But that's spiders. Wish it was something else like zombies or skeletons. Okay, maybe when we get this enchant on our sword too, let's go back into the nether as well. Let's see if we can explore that fortress a little bit. I need to do something about this too eventually. Like this whole hill situation here. There's gotta be a way to fix this, make it look better and like easier to navigate around because I feel like I'm always like looking for the path to get up just jumping around it's never the same path either we're almost there all right we got beds uh, now we need wood it's like a China level <laughs> mega project, true. Like excavating this entire mountain to try to make it look like more flat, like more livable. I'm gonna need a team for that. Okay, we're almost there. We're almost there. Here we go. Secret door. All right, we are looking for wood. More birch. Okay, let's just make as many beds as we can. I think it's six. Yeah, six. Perfect. Okay, put that back. Actually, no, I think we'll be fine. We may need to expand this house though. I was thinking about making like a um maybe a basement floor that might be the way to go yeah actually we dig out this way we'll still be underground we can try that out that way we can put even more beds in here oh shoot i don't have any blocks 
We're gonna have to make do. We'll make this look nicer eventually. This is gonna be like a, a placeholder for now. All right, they're gonna come down here. Maybe one more level. Oops. That's not what I meant. Oh man, it's gonna look like a like a dungeon over here. I don't have any blocks in a world made entirely of blocks. <laughs> True. <laughs> okay, let's dig out this way more. We just want to cram as many of these guys in here that we can. Okay, we have blocks again. We're saved. We do need a light source in here though. I would hate for like a creeper to spawn. Just like ruin everything. This is going to be so weird. Oh shoot, no I don't want that. Mm. I guess we can do that. This place is about to be popping, man. There's going to be so many villagers. Put them right here, because we're going to dig out this way. <laughs> looks like an ordinary house on the outside but when you actually go in and go down here oh my god <laughs> I think that might be the end of the road right here that's fine though we just got a lot more beds available to us doing that yeah perfect you just line them up like that it's like a bunker <laughs> Yeah, we could still fit a bunch more, too. Alright, guys. Home sweet home, right? <laughs> Slum lording it up. For real. <laughs> hey, everyone has a bed. They're all safe from the rain. Everyone's happy. We're all good here. <laughs> Hopefully they make some more iron golems too. That'd be cool. We get like a whole group of those patrolling. Okay. I think I'm ready. Oh wait, no. We want sharpness first. Yeah, let's get sharpness and then go into the nether. You six live in a damp, hand dug or a uh, bare earth basement. You have bed, firelight. You're fine. <laughs> True. <laughs> Just a little bit like roughing it. You guys are good. Okay, we're not gonna need the boat where we're going. Mm, let's put the dirt blocks away. We should carry something with us though for protection. Maybe this deep slate. Cause I'm thinking about like making a like a wall while we push up. Cause if we have that, it would protect us from the fire. I live in a hole on the side of a mountain, so yeah, seems legit. <laughs> Do you really? Do you have like an indoor dug house? I've seen some of those, like the off-grid ones. Those look pretty sick. Hey, welcome back, Toshi. No, oh, I do. Yeah, yeah, I'm in a hole in a mountain. <laughs> you know, we're just just a little dugout area. I was thinking about adding a floor underneath this, though. But I'm not sure what I'm going to put there. Okay. Let's go to sleep. Apparently can't go to... Oh, there we go. We're sleeping. It's better than living in a desert. What do you mean, man? I don't live in a desert. What are you talking about? Oh yeah, okay. Wait. We need the wheat. This is our source of XP right here. 
Stay there. All right. Did the villagers get busy? Six inches of snow outside where I am. Oh, dude. I wish it snowed where I am at. It gets too warm, though. Like, the snow, if it does snow, which is really rare, like, extremely rare, it doesn't stick. Is there camels in California? Uh, at the zoo. Hey, guys. Oh my God. Oh, no. 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 Don't die. Don't die. Please, let me out. Please. Okay, we made it. This is ridiculous. <laughs> this is my XP farm, man. I don't know what else to do. They were extinct because of the nuclear test. <laughs> the world shouldn't not do the livestock. Yeah, we, uh... This is really, um... I'm trying to make use of this, all the space we can here. Oh, due to the livestock. <laughs> it's okay, it's not always gonna be like this. It's just until I get everything enchanted, you know? Come on, see? Look at that XP, look at that jump. Come on, a little more, two more bars. Some cows are taking damage. Dude, when I had the seeds, I was feeding the chickens and it was just like constantly they were dying. <laughs> Feed more chickens, more would die. Your meat is vibrating. <laughs> it is kind of cruel, but it's it's not permanent. It's not permanent. We just have to do this for now. Ah, <laughs> peace and quiet. <laughs> All right, we're going to enchant the sword. Hopefully we get good, like, secondary enchants. Yeah, what's up, Grizzly Mojo? Good to see you, man. Lone bamboo pole. Yeah, that's just kind of for decoration. Okay, let's put our wheat back. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is my train of thought. Like, what was I doing? We're enchanting. Appreciate that. Oh, uh, yeah, stream is going good, man. Hope you're having a good weekend. Wait, not that. Sword. Sharpness three, baby. Oh, that's all it gave us, though. Oh, well. Okay, put those away. Did you grow a big jungle tree? No, not yet. I was waiting until we had, um... What is it? Until we had more jungle saplings. I might actually have to go back into the jungle to get some more saplings. Put the sharpness tree on a book. We already used it though. Oh, to re-enchant the sword? Okay, so if we get another sharpness three, we would do that. Okay. So I think it was to the left. Yeah, it was this way. Oh no, here we go. You smash them together. So I'm gonna need another sword. Like sword plus book transfers the enchantment. Okay. So it's like just disenchanting them. A disenchantment. Wait, wasn't it over here? Am I crazy? Oh wait, no, it was back. Okay, I remember now. It was this way. Can use a grindstone to disenchant and get the XP back. Ah, okay. But if we get like another diamond sword with sharpness three, we can just combine them and get sharpness four then. I think I might just do that. Okay. Let's make this place not feel so scary. Let's make it feel like at home, you know? We need some chickens in here. KFC. 
Okay. Kind of nervous. Uh, we got the sword. Let's switch it like that. I think we're ready. So yeah, these things, they like shoot at us. I was thinking of just doing like a wall like that. Oh my god. What was that? Oh my god! What the f- Is that shooting too? Now we have starving baby chickens in a realm where no grass grows. <laughs> I didn't mean it, man. Oh shoot, no. No, 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 no. That's what was shooting us. Oh yeah, can't you parry that? Uh, I'm not gonna try right now. Hold on. <laughs> I'm like so on edge right now. Uh, do I take down? I think we should bring some ladders, maybe. Snowpowder can extinguish you and another. Snowball do damage on blazes. Oh! We should bring some snowballs. Can we build snowmen in here? That would be kind of cool. I think I might drop down. And then just build like a little staircase up. Oh, I'm going for it. Oh my god. I don't like that. Okay, we got our torches. <laughs> this is scary. We have snow in your- Oh yeah, we do have a lot of snow. Just a pig man? I thought I saw another guy over there. Hold on, what's over here? Okay, we have a dead end here. What hole have you fallen down now? I found a fortress in the nether, Theo. So it's like a big castle here. Okay, we're good, we're good. We're friendly. See, I thought this was something right here. Oh, this guy's not friendly. Am I poisoned? What? What is that? Oh god, I hope I don't die. Please don't kill me. Okay, we're good. Oh, what the? No, no. Dude, they keep spawning. Hold on, I'm getting out of here. Oh no, oh no. Ah. <laughs> oh my god, hold on. Let's get to a safe spot. Jeez. They just kept respawning. Welcome to the jungle, baby. You know where you are. <laughs> Try putting some gems in your shield. Oh, I need some, like, some poison resistance on this shield or something. Dude, that was scary. I didn't think they would, like, respawn like that. Let's just try to get the chest, man. Oh my god. You're kidding. This isn't poison, this is wither, it's worse. Oh god. I don't like the sound of that. Here, I need like a little shield here. Or else that's gonna keep happening. A little safety measure. Okay. Let's do this. Wait, now they're gone. Huh? Oh, this one's back. Spooky skeleton. I got an achievement. I got some iron and stuff. Oh my god! Stop! I wish the pigmen weren't here. I'm scared I'm gonna hit them and just like make them angry. You need milk? Oh, does milk cure you? You got a head that's extra rare? Oh, nice. What does the head do?
coal. Not ready for what the head do. Okay. Oh, milk cures you from every effect. Okay. I don't like this, man. <laughs> oh, the head is to summon a boss. Alright, yeah, we're definitely not ready for that. Whoa, look at all these guys. How about you guys come over here? I'm going for it. This doesn't seem like a good idea. <laughs> oh, can fly shoot firehead? Gives you wither effect at the same time? Okay, that sounds scary. Blazes don't... Oh yeah, you're right. Did I kill it? I don't have any snowballs, unfortunately. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm not sure if I just hit a pig guy or not. I hope not. <laughs> Use your blizzard. <laughs> I wish I was on my sorceress right now. That'd make this a lot easier. Stop! Stop shooting at me. <gasps> oh, I need this. I need this right now. I actually need these. What is that sound? I don't like that sound at all. Oink. <laughs> we got something. We got a blaze rod. Okay. <laughs> God, this is so scary. I feel like I don't belong here. Oh yeah, I saw that, Toshi. I don't think he posted anything though. Oh god. I got an idea. What if I... We got a little uh, hiding spot right here. Suit of diamond armor, I don't belong here. I don't know man, I feel so vulnerable. I feel like I should have some fire resistance. Okay. We're gonna continue. Oh, no. <laughs> oh my god. I hate those things, dude. You can trade it with the piglin. Oh, the blaze rods? I don't want to get lost in here, man. That was a Minecraft version of the doll, true. Just out of nowhere. Those wither skeleton things. Okay, we got another one of these guys. Get down. Get down. Oh my god. Stop, stop, go away, go away. I think I just got another one of those heads. Yeah, we got two of them. Okay, so this is the way back. That's ridiculous luck, is it really? That's cool at least. God, this is so easy to get lost in. Oh, there's another chest. Okay, I'm gonna make more torches right here that's pointing to the direction back. Diamond horse armor. Go, go, go away, go away, go away. Another chest. Another skeleton too. Oh god. I don't like this. Bad day, bad day, bad day. 
like normally you gotta kill two dozen for a head to drop. I'm gonna kill three, yeah. I guess that is pretty lucky. Okay, that's the way back. Open the chest could be a high room. Just trying to get to it. Here we go. Oh, we got a diamond. Dude, these things are quick. Okay, this is the way back. Got more of these guys here. Put some line at the top, they're too tall to pass. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. We can do that too. If we ever get like swarmed or anything. I don't like how close they are to that thing. Can you guys get away from that guy? I don't want to aggro him too. Where if he gets a third head, he has to do it. <laughs> oh no. I hope I don't get the third head then. <laughs> okay, just checking over there. Okay, that's the way back. That's the way back too, okay. Okay, the pig guy is gone. Is this a dead end? Yes. <sighs> okay. So we've got this floor all figured out, I guess. The chests. Okay, that's the way back. There's gold over there. There's another one of these guys. Multiple. Okay, anything over here? Oh, skeleton. And a chest. Let's see. Can we get a high rune? We got armor, got a golden sword. There's some mushrooms here. Okay, this is the way back. I should have brought more torches, man. I think this might be a dead end. Yeah, we're just outside again. Okay. Okay, I'm feeling a little bit more confident now, since I've killed like a few of these things. Oh, scary. It's never really dead end. Would that like lead somewhere if I like dug through anything? Like if I dig through this, I wonder. Is that a staircase? Oh, that is a staircase. What is, what are those sounds? It sounds so gross. Sometimes yes, okay. Okay, that's the way back. Do you have a mini map? No. There's no mini map unless you have like mods. That would be nice though. Let's go check this out. Oh, another chest? Golden oh nether wart. We already have a lot of that though. Yeah, so maybe this would like lead to something. Yeah, just have like a performance mod right now. Just to load stuff faster. Okay, let's not go there. I have a feeling that I'm going to get shot from behind there and it's going to push me into the lava. Then we lose everything again. Okay, so this is all explored then. Wait, we haven't gone up here. Have we? This is where I get lost. More diamonds, horse armor. We're almost full. I think it's just iris and sodium. Lithium doesn't sound familiar. But yeah, it's just for loading the chunks faster. Like rendering speed. That's basically all it does. Okay, let's go this way again. What 
what else haven't we explored here? There's another one of these guys. Okay, we've been here. I don't like this. Did we go down here? I don't... Mm, okay, there's nothing down here. That just drops off. Dude, I hate these sounds right now. It's so creepy. Okay, a lot of those pigmen right there. Okay. The only other place I can think of is pushing forward on that other side. Wait, did we find something else? Did we go over here? A flying pig fan? I didn't even see it. So yeah, this is the only other way... Oh wait, no, we've been over here. Okay. So I think we've seen everything there is to see at this fortress then, right? On the barrier. Iron horse armor. Where's my spyglass? There it is. It's just disappeared. Yeah, I don't know what else we have to get over here. I guess we're gonna go back, because our inventory is full anyway. Uh, this way. Like on the edge, you have an impression that he's in flying. Oh, uh, yeah, I missed it. Oh well. Yo, we got a lot of stuff though. We got seven of these. We got nether wart, which I was like trying to find. We got all this horse armor. We got two of these heads. Not bad. <laughs> that was cool. Oh, time for you to sleep, Toshi? Alright, man. I think we're going this way. Home sweet home. And not too sheep. This is a nice try, though. Nice attempt. Okay, we're back. We're safe. For now. Let's toss all this... All these blocks in here. Um, diamonds. Here's our uh, miscellaneous chest. We have so much horse armor. Do we even need all this horse armor? It's kind of ridiculous. Joko is just sheep, cheap. <laughs> You'll get there, man. You'll get there. <laughs> it takes practice. Okay. Toss those in there. Break down the horse. Oh, you can break it down? How do we do that? Because we don't need all of this. The anvil? can't. Let's try the anvil. I'm not sure. I've never tried it. Oh, that's repair. Would it be that? I have no idea. You can melt the gold ones. Oh, can you melt the diamond? No. Well, if we can salvage some material out of it, why not? We don't need the golden ones. For one ingot? I guess that's better than nothing. Hey, there we go. Nice. We used to have all this, too. Alright. Yeah, better than useless horse armor, for sure. Did we have any more soul sand? Yeah, there we go. We can actually, like, grow some stuff now. Oh, I do have a horse, Toshi. I do have one. I should put this over here, huh? Oh, there's not that much room, though. See, I wanted to make this, like, bigger, but I can't really expand this that much. So I had an idea to make, like, a, a second floor, like, underneath. And make, like, a, a better area for that. Oh, I got a saddle, too. Yeah, I've got a horse already. Where should I plant this stuff, man? I 
I guess we can make that second floor. Oh yeah, that's a good point. I should put the armor on the horse. <laughs> He's just chilling there with nothing. I'll put the bones in here. Yeah, let's get the diamond armor. Still daylight? Yes. Let's see if the villagers have been productive. Still see them out there. Got these two still being lazy in the water. I don't know what, I don't know what they're doing there. Yeah, see, check them out. Here you go. <laughs> Just chilling. Hot tub stream. <laughs> yeah, little hot tub over there. They're just relaxing. Yeah, see we have a little chamber down here. We'll eventually get more beds. Yeah, that drip. We're rocking diamonds right now. Yeah, it's it's a bunker. If we need to, we can just make it lower too, make another level. Okay. I don't want to make that second level now. I think we should be able to. This wet hole in the earth, they'll get ear infections. <laughs> it is probably a little damp in there. Alright, Toshi, I'll catch you later, man. Hope you have a good week, too, brother. I will see you around. Okay, where should we put the staircase if we do do this? I was thinking maybe here. Can't be over there. Make minecart rocket launcher. Is that a thing? Hmm. Oh, there's the oh, it's a stone cutter. Never mind. I thought that was something else. Make a roundabout? I don't know how I'm going to do that in here, dude. <laughs> but I do want to make a second floor. I think I might start it right here. Like, we just dig down, there's a staircase. Big powered ramp launches minecarts to one very precise spot. Oh, that would be a fun challenge. Just, like, launch it in the air. Okay, that's the ceiling. Hmm, maybe... I want to keep that like that, so maybe one more out. And how tall is this? Second story digs hole. If I dig higher up, I'm just going to go outside. So it's like the most room I have is underneath, unfortunately. <laughs> So it's four high. It's the unfortunate thing about this. I have to watch out for this too. Okay, is this four? One, two, three. Need one more. Okay, let's use this pickaxe too. I don't want to waste this other one. But if we do this, we can actually have a nice nether room. And maybe we'll have like a better location. Actually, let's put, do this. Is this in line? I don't think that's in line. Hmm, I guess it doesn't really matter though. As long as... Yeah, that's what I wanted to avoid. Okay. <laughs> Maybe we should go down one more. Yeah, we should probably go down one more. We can fix it. Everything can be fixed here. Let's go down one more. <laughs> ah. We'll have to fix that too. Okay, and we can use that block to tell where we're digging. Yeah, so we're just 
avoiding the um, the elevator right there. But we probably shouldn't dig here because the water's gonna drift out. So yeah, let's actually block this off and go out one more. We'll get like the smooth stone later. It's a different block. Yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna get some smooth stone later. We'll fix it. I just have a lot of like interior design stuff to do still, like make it look nice. I really want this nether room though. I've been like envisioning it for like so long and I didn't have enough space to actually do it over here. So that's kind of like a placeholder for now, I guess. But yeah, we can dig this out, like, pretty easily. Aligned with spooky paintings. Yeah, spooky paintings. We're gonna get some Halloween music, too. <laughs> hmm, should we... No, I guess that's a big enough hallway right there. I'm trying to think what I want to do with this. How big is our other hallway? Two, and this is three wide? Okay. So this is fine. Could do like a three wide hallway here. I want the nether room like in the back a bit more. It would be cool to have like another like a big map room too. Like try to make a huge map of the surrounding area and just have it on a wall somewhere. You know, I probably could use the diamond pickaxe because we do have diamonds to repair it too. Mm. No, I think that uses XP, though. Oh, that's another thing we need to be mindful of. Our little, um, like our slope with the minecart. We don't want to dig into that. So that's like right there. So we're probably... No, we're probably past that now. We're probably like over here right now, underneath. Yeah, we're good. So we could... It's not a torch. We could start digging out this way now. And make the shape of our nether room. Do like a little hallway right here and then we'll expand it out more. One more. Oh, oh dang it. Ruined it. It's okay, we just do this. I kind of want to make it taller too, so I might make a little like maybe one or two steps to go down so I can make the ceiling effectively taller. Hmm. This might take us to another, like, what is it called? Temple? Fortress? Oh, fortress, yeah. Might take us to another fortress. So much cobblestone. Yeah, I kind of want this area to be huge. So we'll come in there. like this. It'll be like a small little staircase down. 
so the ceiling could be taller. Yeah, we're gonna get some lava. We're gonna get some fire going here. It's gonna be pretty sick. We do need some light though for now. While well, we don't have all of that. Oh yeah, this is perfect size. Now, how deep do I want to make this? It's not deep enough yet, just by the looks of it. Maybe two or three more blocks down, or out, I mean. Yeah. Let's try with two first. Oh, we got some iron. That's a nice little surprise. Come on, come on. Okay, and we still have to make like another sword, enchant sharpness three. So, so we can get four. But I mean, so far for right now, the sharpness three is actually pretty good. We were able to kill a bunch of that stuff in the nether. But with bosses, I don't know. We might need something more powerful. Okay, let's switch to this for the iron. Looking good. Okay, might as well do one more out. Let's just finish it with this. Go, go, go. Oh no! Whoops. It's okay, we can fix that later. Alright, does this look big enough? Hmm. Maybe out on the sides more, actually. Yeah, it doesn't look wide enough now. Because we're going to have like stuff on the walls, too. And it's going to make it look smaller. And one more this way. Oh no! Ah. So we can't go that way. Oh dude, I didn't even see that. Wow. That's a bummer. <laughs> no! Okay, it's fine. We could just bring this out more. Box is now uneven, I know. Uh, we gotta bring this back in then. <laughs> the struggle is real. Here's a placeholder. I guess we're going to have to make this longer then. Ah, I thought we were good. I thought we were out of that mine. Hold on. Can we do this? Are we still good doing this? Okay, yeah, that's still fine. Shaber becomes too. No, this is going to look sick when we're done, though. A similar kind of concept. But it's going to be more intense. Because we'll actually have room for the stuff I wanted to do. This might be good. Do we have obsidian? I don't know if we have the obsidian to actually do this yet. We might have to go find some.
Wait, it would be in here. Blackstone. We have two obsidian. Okay, so we need to find some more of that. I swear, you can make it with, like, lava and water, though. I think there's a way to do that. We have to go find some lava. We got our water bucket right here. Good thing we have lava down here, though. Wait, what? Oh no! <laughs> the redstone torch is gone. Ah, broke it. Just need one. Just give me one. <laughs> I just got stopped on the track like that. Hey, wait, what? No. What's going on here? Why is this not working? There we go. Okay, let's try that again. Oh, man. Okay, now we're going down. Okay, so the mission right now, find obsidian. That's like our main goal. But yeah, I'm pretty sure if you just throw water on it, the lava turns to obsidian. Okay, there was lava over here. Come on, come on. I feel so slow. Alright, let's just do this. Yeah, there we go. Look at all that obsidian. Perfect. Dude, I should have just had been doing that in the beginning whenever there was like lava oh well well now we know you know I think I went on that cart ride one at a fair one time <laughs> you know I gotta do that um that little rocket launch Zared is talking about that sounds fun make like a ramp that launches your mine cart pops obsidian falls into lava below oh yeah I gotta yeah, I gotta be mindful of that. I don't want to fall in there. I don't want the obsidian to fall in there. Called it. You did. You did. <laughs> Come on, please. What if I hold shift right next to it? Am I safe? We still get it? Okay, shift works. <laughs> Gotta be so, so meticulous with this. Come on. Leave water flowing. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Let me just do that. Put on some 40% fire res boots with a dwarf star, some fire absorb. Oh, that'd be very handy. Especially in the nether. Can you imagine fire absorb in there? That'd be full HP all the time. Be walking on those lava blocks too. Hey, perfect. We should break some of this other stuff too. It's kind of in our way. Stuff right here. Get out of here. Okay. Let's go after these. Alright, we're at eight. I think we need, I think it's like nine or ten. Oh, wait, no, we still. Let's just get one more because we have the two back at home. All right. Now, how do we get back for here? Yeah, I think it's this way.
No, never mind. Why does this always happen? I don't even know where this is. <laughs> but I dug out here, apparently. This is the way. Yeah, I see the track right there. Gonna pop over to my mate stream. He's playing the beta for the new game I was telling you about. Won't be long. Famous last words. All right, Theo. Well, thanks for stopping by. Hope the beta looks like fun. I think it was that Warhammer game, right? Or is that already out? The uh, Warhammer Dark Tide, I think it was. Yeah, Dark Tide. Okay. Yeah, I still gotta check out those games. They they seem pretty fun. We're back. All right, let's grab our other two obsidian here. And well, we don't need to light up the portal yet. We do need this though. Then we're gonna bring this out one more too. And we'll replace this floor with the nether rack. I think I'm just gonna leave that iron there. We're going to have two nether portals. Well, that's okay. Maybe this one spawns like a cooler location. Oh, we need more. And maybe we can make like a nether staircase too. Can we? No. Sad. Alright. We'll make cooler staircases later. This is the start, though. Okay. Let's get our little portal situation all figured out. We do it right here. Was it two or three? I can't remember if it was two or three for the base. I think it was three. Oh, it's two. Okay. It's two and one, two, three tall. Got both your streams up. Wi-Fi is being nice to me today. Aw. I'm glad to hear that. Oh, this is going to be off -side, uh, lopsided. Oh, I can't win, dude. I just can't win with this. Oh, well. this and then boom and boom all right now what we need is lava I'm not gonna grab that one. Oh, I wonder if we can make infinite lava can I just dump this in here I can. Perfect. 
Let's go back down, grab some lava. No, this way. Come on. Here we go. Oh, there's no infinite lava, so you can't do the same thing with, like, the water. Okay. Dang, I should have made another bucket then. Oh, well, this trip's not too bad. Wait, that's not the way. It's over here. Yeah, I should make more buckets, honestly. Oh god, <laughs> that's a bad idea. I'm, like, about to spill the lava bucket right in front of me. Yeah, we've got the iron to spare. We can make more buckets. if there's a lava source that's closer make copper buckets that's a thing I didn't know that was a thing let me try that because yeah we have all that copper you've got so much copper oh it's not oh my god <laughs> you had me for a second that would be cool copper buckets I mean, these are cheap enough, though. Let's just do four, I guess. So we'll have five in total. Can you make copper blocks to get decorate? Oh, yeah! You actually can. Oh, wait. Hold on. We have to fix this. I forgot... I gotta fill this wall out. Sad. Uh, wait, this is still gonna be solid copper block path to the nether portal. Ooh, that's a good idea too. Wait, did I fix that? Now it looks weird. I think I'm just gonna keep it like that. Even though it's kind of lopsided. We could even make this bigger too, but... I was thinking something like this. Oh god, no. <laughs> Not like that. <laughs> I was playing the beta over the weekend, and apart from some tech issues, I like what I see so far. Oh, that's good to hear. Let's see how many uh, copper blocks we can make. For that, you need uh, built inside glass. Oh, yeah, glass panels. That's something we don't have. Um, use the lava light a lot in my temple of death. Or temple to death. I like the lava light a lot. It adds that certain ambience. Oh, new recipe? Okay. Hear that lightning outside? Spooky. make this bigger now found a use for copper for real we finally have a use for copper I could bring it out this way dude that lightning is intense out there I'm so bummed out about this though Ah. Make entrance one block wider. Oh, that's a good point. That might make it look better. Well, 
up. I just ruined that. We'll fix it. Yeah, we can do it right here. Saved. Oh, wait, we do need to break this. <clears throat> Saved! Oh, that looks so much better. Yeah. Dude, that is intense. Surge protector. Yeah, definitely, yeah, feels better that way. And there's gonna be stairs there. These will be the um, the copper blocks. Ooh, we're getting fancy now. Then right here too. There's gonna be stairs covering this, so we don't need to worry about that. Looks like Mario three. <laughs> okay, we're gonna need sand. We don't have any sand. I'm trying to think if there's like a, a desert nearby or something. I don't think there is. Oh no. We need another chest. Sandless popper. I don't know where the sand is, man. I'm fresh out of it. Oh, we had extra buckets here the whole time? Okay. All right, we're gonna go on a mission. I need to grab that bed. Did I already use that bed? I think I gave that bed away to the villagers. <sighs> yeah, I don't have any other beds. Okay, we have that boat though, right? Yeah, we have the boat. I'm gonna have to take that bed back. Oh yeah, under the ocean, duh. Yeah, there's sand in the ocean. <laughs> Okay, we don't have to go too far then. Where's my shovel? I should make another one. Yeah, that lightning was intense. One shovel. We're going in. Forget the elevator this time. We're just jumping. Oh wait, this is... That's not sand. I don't know what this is. What is this? Oh, it's gravel. Just my luck. I mean, like a gravel ocean. <laughs> Where's the sand? Yo, what is this? Underwater cave? Do I have... I do, okay. Just making sure. <laughs> There's no sand here at all. Yeah, even the ocean hates me. <laughs> ah. I see sand. Yar, over yonder. There's not much there though. We really need to find a desert. There's some here too. Dude, those vines. They're almost all the way back down now. Crazy. Alright, we don't need too much. It would be nice to have a bunch, though. Come on, come on. More. Oh, there's sand over there, too, I think. I see it. Yeah, desert would be way more efficient. But, you know, it's alright.
I'll grab from right here. Yes! We hit the jackpot. I think we just get like one stack, we'll be good. Nope, going up. We're excavating the ocean floor. Okay, halfway there. Come on. Stop drowning. Desert? Nah, drown getting sand. <laughs> that one, it's like that one Drake meme. Desert? Nah. <laughs> Forty-seven? Come on. Get in there. Forty-eight? I wish you could, like, mine and, like, gather underwater at the same speed. I feel so slow. Okay. Almost done here. Let's get four more. There's two right there, so two more. Wait. One more. Okay, that's enough. Going back. Where's my house again? Oh, over here. Could use this as navigation. Our little um, sugar cane field. It's that bamboo. The one single bamboo. <laughs> Wish sand drops didn't float in water. Yeah, it's kind of annoying having to like go and like pick them up, like swimming. All right. Hey, we actually get to test out our elevator, like the legit way. There we go. Going up. Home sweet home. All right, we got the sand. Now we need to make the glass. Wow, they get, oh my God. One gold nugget. I was thinking it would give you, like, the other one. Like, the raw gold. Not, like, one nugget. <laughs> That's so small. Bro. Took the bat boat to the bat cave and up the bat elevator. <laughs> I was just waiting for that. <laughs> to the bat cave! Okay. We might need to split this. Yeah, let's split this. There we go. Alright, now that's going. Need to make more chests over here, too, eventually. Uh, we can do it right now. Got a lot of oak planks. Finally removes three-day-old cooked chicken from oven. <laughs> I was going to get around to it, man. It's like, you know, you leave the dishes in the sink for a bit. Like, it's soaking right now. It's marinating. That's my excuse. Just marinating. Look at all that space. I feel like eventually I'm going to make these, like, horizontal. No, we'll see. <laughs> that chicken was in there for a bit, though. Alright. The glass that we do have... I think we want to do the panes. How do you do that, though? Is that it? Yeah, how do you do the pane? This one. Okay. So that makes 16. Dude, we're getting all the recipes now. We might, yeah, we might be good. Let's see what we can do with this. Oh, it's over here. You marinate before cooking. <laughs> yeah, I kind of had it uh, reverse, I guess. 
Nope. Ruined. <laughs> cat. No, 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 cat man. They're so hard to work with. Okay, that's a start. Did this work? Yes. Gotta be very precise here. All right, we need more though. Nice. All right, we got 64, that should be good. Okay, let's grab our buckets and our lava bucket. I think I was gonna dig this out too. Still waiting for you to think about how you're gonna fill it. What do you mean? We got this. Because we're going to do it like that, right? We'll figure it out. <laughs> That's the start, though. Then we can dig these out right here. Yeah, this is going to look so nice. Looking good. Oh my god. Why? Okay, let's leave that like that. Let's go get some more lava now. We've got six buckets in total. We're gonna get so much lava. No, this way. Go, go, go. Did I just slow it down? <laughs> Does that slow it down? That's so weird. It feels like it slows it down. I don't know. Maybe it's that that's my imagination. Anyway. Huh? Oh. Nice. We got the lava. That was convenient. And go! Yeah, we're gonna have to do some kind of acrobatics to fill it, I think. We shall see. Can I eat while I'm writing this? Oh, I can. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. I mean, they ask so much of us. 
to believe that a person can carry a bucket of lava, but to suspend enough belief that carrying six wouldn't kill you. <laughs> Not one bucket, but six. <laughs> yeah, how am I going to do this? Ah, I see. I know what I'm going to do. Oh, God. All right, that's one section. Swap these out. This is so bad. Glass. Oh, yeah, you're right. I need more right here. See, we're good. Then we can do that. Then we can fill these last two, or last few. Break that. We don't need that anymore. Okay, we got two more buckets. That's <laughs> scary. Oh, we're gonna need one more. Because we have that. No, 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 no. Okay, this is gonna... It's gonna take some uh, concentration. <laughs> Let's do this side too. This is where it gets sketchy, yeah, I'm like, hmm. Gotta think about that. Let's go get some more lava. hole right here. Love that. <laughs> so convenient. Alright, and I think the rest of the glass might be finished, or we might have enough. Okay. You can feel it just like barely pulling us up enough. Just enough to the next powered rail, that's it. It gets a little bit better over here, though. Oh, there we go. And... Let's go get our little uh, glass stuff, too. Copper, man. That copper looks nice. I have an idea. Hmm. Alright. We do this. This would block it off, hopefully. I guess I'm taking my chances here. Hey, there we go. Then we just need to be quick about this one. Put the glass on too. There we go. Look at that. Beautiful. Okay, now we gotta do this side. Ah. <sighs> this is still sketchy though. Wait, is this? Okay, we have to do that section right there. There we go. Got that. Got that one. Okay. 
I think I'm all just fell in. Cool. Lunch is up and food is the word. Catch you next time. Alright, Theo. Hope you enjoy your lunch. And yeah, have a good rest of your day too. Thanks for stopping by. Okay, we got one more little journey for lava. We need three buckets? Yeah, we just need three more buckets. all this glass. Kind of crazy. Okay, I'm just going to grab three. Because I don't know what I'm going to do with the other lava. Is it out? It's alright, we got that. Yeah, three lava buckets, perfect. Oh wait, what am I talking about? We still have 60 right here. <laughs> yeah, I thought we used up all of it almost. No, we're good. curious to see like where we spawn in the nether from this one okay that's one it's so sketchy okay same thing let's do this yikes wait is that what I did no I think that's too early I don't like this at all. Oh no. Please don't, please don't. I guess that works. Very sketchy though. God. Okay, we did it, nice. Sweet. Okay. Now we need to light this bad boy up. Yeah, let's see where we spawn. There's a wild cat. It's okay. You can chill here for a bit. my sword. Alright, here we go. <laughs> Immediately gets shot. <laughs> Wait, what? It's the same exact portal! It's weird. Oh, they would- Oh, it overlaps? That's kind of lame. Well, at least we got that area worked out. Alright. Well, we can start planting this stuff too now. Let's make an area for the nether wart. Okay, we need soul sand. Oh yeah, we could do that with the old portal room. 
That could be like our little nether wart area. I don't know if we need that much though. Because we could turn this into something. The darkness. I don't need this anymore. Come on. Could buy a portal. I guess this is an okay size for the nether wart. It's not too big. I can't remember what we use it for, though. There's probably like some kind of potion or something. Dog wants out? Okay. No worries. Oh my god, it takes so long to break. Hurry up. Come on. Just a few more. Okay, three more. Yeah, and we'll replace this floor with all the soul sand, I think. There we go. Hear that wild cat again. Yeah, we could turn this into nether wart and something else maybe. I don't know what else though. I guess this will be like a placeholder for now. Oh geez, I hope we have enough of this. Hmm, cutting it close. Oops. Okay, we're good. We have enough. And let's go ahead and plant this stuff. Alright, well that's growing. Cool. All that away. I can hear the portal from over here. It's like underneath us somewhere. Okay, so now I th think we want to work on enchanting again. Maybe the boots next. So what do we have available for the boots? Depth Strider. I don't think we want that. And boots and what else? Another sword, because we want sharpness three. Another sharpness three. Okay, there's another diamond sword right there. And also the fishing pole, because we want luck of the sea. So what does this give us? Knockback. Fishing pole gives us unbreaking. What does the hoe give us? Efficiency. Okay, so we don't want any of those. 24 degrees ain't right. Oh, dude, that's so cold. Ugh. Yeah, I'm not a fan of winter that much. Even though it doesn't get, like, too cold here, it still kind of sucks. Protection 4. 
We're gonna do that, just re-roll. Depth Strider, no. Sweeping Edge, no. Unbreaking, no. What about the helmet? We should be checking the helmet too. Aqua Affinity. I don't think we want that. Okay, that's piercing. What else are we getting? Don't like winter weather, but I like what winter does for society. Like, what do you mean? Like, staying indoors or... Respiration. <gasps> does that let you breathe underwater? Hold up. I've never seen that one before. Increases the time breathe underwater. Okay. Keeps the rest of the humans in their houses away from me. That's a good point. I don't know if I want that. Oh, wait. We have silk touch with the hoe. I guess we can make that. Wait, do we want it on the hoe, though? I'm not sure. I'm going to keep that, though. I'm not going to re-roll it again. Okay, I'm going to put the sword here. Put this back on. Eat the chicken. Alright, let's go check on our farm. Still have some daylight, so that's good. Oh, looks like a lot of the wheat's ready. Some farmers. Are these guys still in the water? Yes. Now the iron golem's in the water, too. Perfect. What is that? What is that? Oh, he's... Okay. Not going to be really much use in the ground like that. I don't know how he got in there. All right. Yeah, I don't know what that's about. Anyway. <laughs> I need all these seeds. Who planted the carrot? I planted them originally, but I think they must have, like, picked those up. Yeah, this is supposed to be all wheat. I don't know what they're doing with these potatoes. Oh my god! Please don't kill me. Do I have to kill him? I think I have to kill him now. Because he's going to, like, wreck me. Right? <laughs> oh my god. Sorry, bud. Has to be this way. Okay. <laughs> that was scary, man. Yeah, I want all these seeds. Never smacked an iron golem with a hoe myself. <laughs> I knew it was going to cause trouble, man. Just had a feeling. we haven't gotten attacked yet oh yeah we got a ton of seeds now I'm just waiting for the creeper to come up behind us and just ruin everything any second now Yeah, see, I wish they would just do this themselves. Oh well. Almost. We're gonna have some left over for the chickens, too. Oh, hey there. I'm 
just ruining everything. No. The jumps. I shouldn't be jumping. Oh my god. Stop. We good? We're good. Should not be farming at night. Oh no. Come on, we need more than this. Nope, nope. Mm mm. Not today. Oh god, oh god, no, no, no. Get back. God, it's so scary. <laughs> I hate those things so much. Nice, we got the arrow back too. Oh, hey, this is another way to level, right? Bro, you ruined my field. Okay, it's getting serious now. I need, like, an arena. I should make just like a huge flat area that's dark. There we go. Oh no, they killed the sheep. They killed the cow. <laughs> so dumb. The absolute carnage right now. Oh, there goes our one sheep. Look at all this experience, though. Always watch your back. See Creeper down there? Alright, we got level 29. Still got some XP trickling in, though. I think that's it. All right. Let's go pick a fight. Ooh, got him. One shot, one kill. Another creeper. Yeah, it's the only downside of this mountainous area. So much jumping, dude. Can't really see either. Like, it'd be nice if there's like a desert nearby. Then we can just like farm monsters in there. <gasps> it's this guy. Will we be safe if we hit him here? <sighs> they killed him. Oh, nice, we got an ender pearl. There's another one. I just saw him. Disappeared. Yeah, I got an eye. Die. Let me see if I can get that other one. There he is. They do not like eye contact for whatever reason. Hey, I'm looking at you, bro. Oh god. He's pissed. How dare you look me in the eye. We're safe under the tree. Kinda. Did we get another one? No. 
I think we have two of these now. There's another one right there. Hey, I'm looking at you. Bro, stop. Gonna need a lot more eventually. Dude, he just killed himself. <laughs> I didn't even attack. It's like he like parried himself and like punched himself in the face. Yeah, we're gonna have to farm a lot of these guys someday. Hey, we're getting some decent XP though. Thank you. Oh, sun's coming up. It's kind of fast. Don't want this right now. Or that. Zombie, I see you. Get over here. Give me your XP. Why oh, are you running? I see you. Oh, we got one more over there. Let's heal up and kill that one too. Here, making eye contact from all the way over here. He can tell. <laughs> he hates it, man. He hates it. Oh. Hey, we got level 30 and... Oh, wait. We got three pearls now. Should make a pit of darkness. Oh, that's a good idea. So we can, like, farm monsters inside that. That's a good point, actually. Maybe that's something we can make inside of our base. Like with that extra room? Hmm. Not in the base? Okay, I won't make it in the base. <laughs> that probably is a bad idea. <laughs> Uh-oh. We got company. It's very specifically not there. <laughs> They're pissed. I found their outpost and I torched it. So now they're coming after me. Yeah, we've, we have a little uh, backstory going here. Yeah. Maybe... Hmm. Oh, what if I build it in the mine? Like, away from the base, though. What is this? Oh, is that the... We have a librarian now. I think that's what that is. Hey, man. Yeah, it's a librarian. Perfect. Alright, I think that's what I'm going to do. Let's take the mine cart. Let's go deep into the mine. And we'll, like, hollow out an area. That'll be kind of like our, um... Our Thunderdome. Where did my... Oh, did that break? I think my helmet broke. What is that? Oh, that's the, um... That's from the iron golem we killed. So our farm is, like, right here. You'd want to build it a full chunk away from base. So probably in the mine is probably good, right? Oh, let's put this stuff away. So we have five of these now. Got some iron. Also, easier to build it in the sky with cobble than it is hollow out of a mountain. Oh, that's a good point, too. Hmm. But also, if we build it, like, underground, we can always farm there, though, right? So I feel like... There might be an advantage to that if we build it underground. You ideally want it to be a 64 by 64 by 64 cube. Oh, wow, okay. All right, I see how that's going to be difficult underground. Hmm. Let's 
grab this. With zero light. Okay, so we, regardless, we need like a big box. We can find a place to build this. I might as well grab this stuff too. Okay, we're full. Okay, yeah, let's build this away from the base then. Hmm. Kind of want it out of sight though. Let's take the boat. And turn around. This is where you start changing the planet. Like a magic the gathering artificer. <laughs> Random chicken. What if we put it in there? That's already pre-built. Eh, let's make our own. Let's make it away from stuff, though. Maybe over here. I don't want to be able to see it from base. <laughs> I think this might be good though. Way cooler, but way harder. Sphere of Darkness. Yeah, that does seem difficult. Yeah, you can still see your base from here. I don't want it over here then. Let's get out of the render distance. I don't want to see just some like random block. This will be our version of the Thunderdome. Alright. Slowly rendering away. What is that? Oh, we were already there before. Dude, that is massive though. 64 by 64 by 64. Jeez. Oh no, I don't have space. I guess... Oh, we'll get rid of the flesh. We don't need that. Is this a good spot? I can see the fences. That's alright though. Let's go a little bit further out here. Okay, I guess... Let's start it right here. Alright, here goes nothing. Um, how are we going to do this? 64 isn't necessary per se, but 64 by 64 by 32 would probably work. Okay. That's a little bit easier. So like 32 tall. I guess we'll use this as a marker. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ten. Ten. Four, twenty-five, twenty-six. Thirty-one. Two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six. Forty. You could go twenty X, but it would generate monsters slow as hell. Yeah, see I want it to be pretty quick. Thirty one, forty two. Fifty-six, fifty seven, fifty eight. 59, 60. Oh my god, that's far. Okay, then I guess we'll go this way then. So we'll go 64 this way. 2, 3, 4. Six. Twenty 
27, 28, 30, 35, 40, 41, 2, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. Finally, mega project number one. True. We finally do have a mega project. 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64. Oh my god, dude, that is massive. No kidding, dude. Stay a while and listen. Yo, thanks for the raid, Shiren. Appreciate that. Yeah, what's up, Laser Guana? Here, link to that shout out. Yeah, I just got my new, um, my alert. It's Deckard came from Diablo. But yeah, how was your stream? Wait, what? Oh, shoot, my bad. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like thinking and like talking at the same time. I'm, like typing and talking. <laughs> there we go. Ooh, the new Pokemon. How's that going? Today you'll say something you thought you never would. I need more cobblestone. Oh god, I hope it doesn't get to that point. But yeah, thanks for the raid, Shiren. Hope you had a good stream. It's so fun. Oh, it's open world, right? That seems pretty cool. Oh, dude, yeah, this is massive. Oh, my God. I'm kind of regretting building it over the water now. Yeah, what's up, Craig? How you doing, man? I haven't seen you in a while. So, I guess this is our first mega project. Um... We're trying to build like a little arena, like a Thunderdome, just so like monsters spawn in it. You can technically challenge the gyms in any order. Ooh, that's actually pretty sick. So you don't have to go like linear. I've had COVID, it's sad. Better now though, okay, that's good. Yeah, COVID, oof. I did not like having COVID when I had it. Although I had it like minor personally. I know some people had it like a lot worse, probably like a different strain. No, overwater is perfect. Forces spawns inside due to spawning not being allowed on the water. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. So now we have to. Oh my god, we have to fill this out. Satellite can't stay. We're going out of town for hibachi. Oh, that's the one where they cook in front of you, right? Oh, have fun with that. That sounds awesome. It was better than last time I had it, but it was still pretty bad. Oh, dang, so you've had it twice now. Jeez. Well, I'm glad you recovered. Glad you're good now. Oh, it is the one? Okay. Yeah, definitely enjoy that. That sounds like a good time. All right, thank you again for the raid, Chiron. Appreciate that. Okay. Well, we're about to spawn stuff at night right now, so I'm going to get ready to fight. We have that as a marker. But yeah, this is going to be 64 by 64 by 32, maybe? We might go to 32. We'll see. But it's going to be like a big cube, like a cube of darkness. And we're just going to be like fighting in here. Possibly three times. The first was when it first appeared, so no diagnosis. Oh, yeah, I remember that. It took me a while. Like, I think when I had it was maybe... I would say like four or five months ago, maybe. Something like that. Okay, maybe... Dude, I don't want to like start building this. It's like... You know, I don't want us to get messed up. I guess I can build this part. This is going to take you forever. I know. I'm going to run out of cobblestone, too. Like when I made a house and decided I didn't like a mountain in front of the house. <laughs> oh, did you like demolish a mountain? I built my base inside of a mountain because I thought it would be easier. I guess it comes with its own problems though. But it's fine. It, it turned out okay. Mine the mountain down. It took weeks. <laughs> my first sky castle I made a made to blot out the sun because some other guy on the server warped to me to build his base. <laughs> That's some revenge right there. Like, oh yeah, you want to build next to me? You get no sun then. 
I love it. Yeah, at least if we do it this way, we don't have to count. <laughs> we got the uh, outsides done. I had someone with me too. She was like, I hate you. <laughs> yeah, that is kind of ridiculous. <laughs> like, all right, I guess I got to demolish this entire mountain now. <laughs> Jeez, weeks though. I don't know how long this is going to take. Hopefully not long. I don't, I don't know. Because we can make it 32 tall. Right? We don't. doesn't have to be 64. Okay, I'm going to get shot any second now. Something's going to shoot me. I can feel it. The skeleton archers are like locked on target right now. You can make it 10 tall. Oh shoot, I might just do that. That sounds way easier. <laughs> I was giving you the biz about height. Uh, okay. If you get a cobblestone maker going, it won't take too long. There's a cobblestone maker? Look at that. Excellent parry. Okay, so if we can do it 10 tall, it'll be a lot faster then. That's fine. I'm cool with that. Lava flowing into water makes cobble. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. You can get lava and water flow together. It just makes cobblestone. Okay. Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, I have a bunch of mined already. That's a good point. I have so much cobblestone. We just have to, like, go back and forth and get it. Our base isn't too far, though, but I just wanted to build this away from the base. Cause it's gonna be like kind of like an eyesore. <laughs> what is that? Oh, it's a fish. <laughs> this music's so chill. I know, dude. I love the Minecraft music. I wish it played more often. Like it's so rare when it plays. Turned mine off ages ago because I played so much. Oh, dude. I, I can't play without the music, man. It's just so good in this game. But I, I guess I can see that. Wait till the first creeper spawns on it while you're building and makes a hole in your floor needs to be repaired. Oh, no. Yeah, I don't want the creepers to spawn. Please, no. I know it's going to happen, though. Maybe we should torch this area, too, so they don't spawn, like, here? I don't know. Like, just in case, you know? Then we can, like, break them later. Yeah. Let's do that. Oh, there's a the thing. This guy. Let's make eye contact. They hate eye contact. Get over here. What do you want, dude? What do you want? Let's go. Let's go. Okay, I'm gonna bring the fight to you. Oh my god. He's so mad. He's so mad. Where did he go? He just gave up. Bro. The instant transmission. This game kind of suits you. You speak so soft. The game's chill. Perfect match. Yeah, I can see it. That's a pretty good match. Uh, pretty good mix. Yeah, I love these kind of games. They're just so mellow. And it's like easy to get distracted and do like other things. Hey, we got another pearl. So I think that's like, what, four total? Yeah, I think we got four total now. Four or five. I'm terrible for that. <laughs> no distractions, all pit of darkness. Yeah, I think the last time I saw you stream, it was uh, Resident Evil, right? I don't know if you're still playing that or not. You know I've never played a Resident Evil game. I go off saying I'll go get some cobblestone five hours later and I'm in a cave. I mean, you technically did get uh, cobblestone, right? You just kind of got sidetracked. <laughs> you stream that a lot. Yeah. 
I was like looking for the Diablo streams, man. Which was it? Uh, shoot, I don't remember, dude. Do you stream multiple Resident Evil games? I honestly, I don't know. I just remember it was Resident Evil. Because, yeah, I'm not too familiar with that series. Was it meant to do some Diablo with a friend, actually? Ooh, okay. Hold down the click, man. Save your finger. Oh, good point, yeah. I wish I didn't have to hold shift, and I could just run at normal speed. Man, I'm so excited for Diablo 4, though. It's going to be so fun. Oh my god. <laughs> There's so much still. Uh... Well, we can start that. What a project, man. I did not expect to be doing this today. Wait, is this faster? Oh god, no. Questionable. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I wish I could have like a villager do this for me. Like have a mason villager. Uh, yeah, I'll place the structure for you. Just do the outline. Only faster if you got the skill to never F it up. Yeah, I don't have that skill. I'm going to fall in the water immediately. Oh, here we go. Does that work? Prayer pack, need a beer, can't take it anymore. <laughs> Yo, this is faster. Going like at an angle. I was playing the director's cut from 1996 last time. Play the remake of 2 and 3, also play 7 and 8. Oh, okay. I think it was one of the newer ones. Either that or it was a remaster. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, they have a bunch, though. Oh, my God. Let's do the outline. Waiting for the remake of 4 in February, if I remember right. Is 4 the one that was on the GameCube? I remember there's one on the game on the GameCube. Oh look, horses. Oh, I thought I was holding shift. <sighs> Not sure. Or never played on the GameCube. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't remember what number that was. That might have been the GameCube, though. Did you fall? Yeah, I fell. I know they did have a Resident Evil on the GameCube, though. I just can't remember what number it was. I think he started out in a village. I don't know if that's helpful or not, but... <laughs> he started off in a village. Pretty sure. Can't you sit, crouch, hold, or tab in the options? I'm holding uh, the crouch right now. I just thought I was holding crouch before, but I was holding control, unfortunately. Build out three, then fill in the chunks of nine blocks? Wait, what? Build out three. You mean like the borders of three? Then build out the center? Then fill in the center, you mean? tell if that's even or not. I'm gonna go from over here. Oh. Let me try that. So... I mean, if you tap shift, you stay crouched? Oh! Is that a setting? Controls. Auto jump. Sneak hold. Oh, toggle. There you go. Oh, yeah. Good good call. 
So wait, build out three and fill in the chunks. So do something like this. Oh, I kind of messed that up. So I'll do this. It seems a little bit faster. Can I not get that? Oh my god. <laughs> I need a beer too. <laughs> That's how I do it, walk backwards, just add underneath me. Feels better, not sure if faster. It does feel better, I don't, hmm. Let's try this again. Yeah, I can't tell, dude. It feels faster when you go diagonal like this, though. Like, versus going backwards. I don't know if there's like, I don't know. It's still kind of slow, though. <laughs> Regardless. Hey. <laughs> Got some like manual labor in Minecraft right now. Just don't knock the shift button. <laughs> yeah, gotta be careful. This does seem faster though, like strafing like this. We're gonna have to go back for more cobblestone though soon. Come on. If you're going to do straight lines, do yourself a favor, skip to then line repeat. Do you mean like I would start from right here or skip to and go like this and then go out? Oh, wait. Yeah. What if I do this? Oh, shoot. Dude, hell yeah, there we go. Efficiency right here. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Yeah, that's way faster. Oh my god. Until that happens. Yeah, that's way better. Oh yeah. Alright, we've got a few more stacks left. We just increased the time by 3x. Burning through cobble now. Playing console so controller isn't so quick. Oh dude, yeah, I could imagine this on controller. Oh my god. That would be tough. Okay, reverse direction. I don't like it. <laughs> Let's go back over here. Reverse direction's harder for me, for some reason. <laughs> no. Gotta stick with the tried and true. Yeah, exactly. Whatever makes it work. We got this. Wait, what happened? I lost the groove. Wait, there we go. We got it back. Did we? Leave those single mistakes too. Come back and fix them later. Oh, that's a good point too. Yeah. Take some time to like switch the pickaxe and break them. All right. I'm running out of stuff here. We're gonna have to head back soon. There we go. 
You know what? It's fine. It doesn't have to all be one, like, thing. It's gonna be janky, but that's okay. I'm all for it. Just a dungeon, who cares? Yeah, true. Alright. We gotta go get some more blocks now. Dun, dun, dun. Let's just place these over here. Alright, do we have our boat? Yes, we do. Okay. I think our base is this way. Yeah, it's right over there. The base is for making things pretty. Yeah. <laughs> Still working on that for my base, too. It'll get there eventually. I do like that little nether room now, though. With that copper walkway. It's pretty nice. See, there's a base over there. Right in that mountain. There's the tree of life. Got some waterfalls coming down. We have our own little bat cave, too. With an elevator. Yeah, the copper walkway is the shit. It's so nice. So far away. Yo, maybe eventually... Mm. Nah, maybe not. I was thinking maybe doing like a rail system over here. Nah. The boat's fast enough. We would have to, like, tunnel in the ocean, too, or something. Yeah, I'm good. Alright, where's our entrance? There it is. Kind of hidden here. Alright. Going up. I love this thing. There we go. Our little storage area. Oh yeah, we have an ender pearl now. We got some coal. Let's drop this stuff in here. Don't need that. Don't need this. That too. Got some eggs. Redstone torch. Making a bunch of room now. I guess I'll keep the shovels. Okay, that's fine. Eventually, as you use the pit more and more. You'll make a prep room on the side of it to hold all the implements of battle. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Get like extra gear, get food and stuff. Okay, not gravel. Basalt we can use. Deep slate's fine. I don't want to use netherrack for some reason. Oh no, we're still good. Look at all this. <laughs> So much stuff, so much material. Oh, almost nighttime. I guess we can go to sleep. Netherrack's useful for other things. Yeah. I like that you can set it on fire. I think that's pretty cool. All right, going down. Wait, going down? Herman nether torches are cool. Yeah, those things look so sick. Maybe we'll do that on the outside. Oh, that would be so cool. Have some nether torches on the outside. How you cook your food. Oh, I just do it all in the uh, the furnaces. Is there a different way to cook them? But yeah, I always use the uh, just like the furnaces with coal. Make a fire pit thing. Oh. Could you do that with like the netherrack? Like make like a fire pit? You can put four pieces on each. So do you just like... Do you just throw like raw meat on fire and it cooks it? I wonder how that works. You place it on the corners. I'm gonna have to try that out. That sounds cool though. It's a specific new food thing. It's 
free cooking rather than wasting coal. Oh. That's a good point, yeah. Try to conserve some of that coal. Okay, I think we're here. Give me that. Oh, shoot. Wait, I can't hold that. No. Okay, what are we getting rid of? Sticks. Hey, spider. Good to see you, man. Okay, that's like one thing I gotta get used to. I'm like shifting and I'm like, wait, why am I moving so slow? Oh yeah, it's toggle now, just like the run. I gotta remember that. Wait, oh, there it is, okay. <laughs> to be continued. This stuff sounds like so heavy. What is this? Basalt. Basalt is heavy. Yeah. It definitely has the sound of it. Compared to cobblestone. Cobblestone sounds so light. Let's go, speed it up. I hope we have enough materials. Oh, dude, that's what I can do. I can make a boat chest. Oh, shoot, I should have done that. Next time, next time I'll do a boat chest. You can do walls three height at a time like this too. I'd only do the walls on the perimeter though, right? Oh, I see what you're saying. But yeah. So we would go like... Oh, shoot. Yeah, the walls seem easier. Wait. Oh, there we go. We have to do shift for it. Yeah, the walls will definitely be the easier part. Once we get like this floor all set up, it's gonna be a lot faster. You know, I think we're actually making good progress, like going this way. We've almost reached the other side. this blackstone you know blackstone sounds kind of cool i wonder if it looks cool if like you smelt it or make it smooth i don't know where i got this stuff crushing this actually yeah getting better dude the more i do it the better i get okay going back this way yeah we're almost done then we just have the walls next i just have to do it this way this way's a lot better okay we're gonna start off oh. Just try not to fall. <laughs> okay, I'm crouching. I'm crouching. Let's do this.
This is going to be so sick, though, to have an arena for this. I can't wait. We're going to level up so fast, too, because all the monster kills. And hopefully we get, like, a bunch of Endermen, too. Nowhere near your crops or villages. True, true. We're actually safe over there. Oh, that's something I should do at our base, too. I should make more torches. Just so nothing, like, spawns near them. Make it a little bit safer outside. That's an idea. To make nether torches? No. I don't think that's the vibe. I'll do, like, lanterns, maybe. No. I want to save the netherrack torches for over here, maybe. I don't know if I want those by the base. Oh yeah, glowstone. That's a good one. <laughs> but the netherrack torches, that seems too intense. strip lightning that drops every seven. <laughs> that sounds kind of scary too, man. <laughs> the lava and fire stuff, maybe I'd save that for over here. And the nether room, of course. Bro, we are burning through this stuff. Strip lightning is perfectly safe in glass, nowhere near the creepers. Oh, in glass, okay. I wonder how that would look. Would you just do kind of like lava pillars then? Just random lava pillars? I like the lantern look a lot, like the iron lantern. I think those are cool. Oh my. Gotta crouch. Now you make it hanging in the sky with essentially a trench of floating glass. How high up do you make it? Sounds interesting. Like what your bridges over it looks like. I'll have to look that up. Using lava as lightning. Sun setting. Oh my god, we're almost there. We're almost there. Oh, dude. <laughs> I forgot. There's the ceiling, too. Uh, maybe the ceiling won't be too bad. The only downside is like falling down from the ceiling. We should probably have a bed nearby. No, I'm wasting it. About 10 up the air over pits when you mine.
Do you mean like when you're building the roof or is that something else? Because we probably could do some kind of safety mechanism maybe. to build one high safety walls on a one wide bridge I do not <laughs> I have no idea actually safety walls oh wait no I, I know what you're talking about so you don't fall off the path yeah okay I see what you're saying okay so yeah we could do that so we don't fall then okay that's a good point. Why are these all different? <laughs> We're running out. Could have low-key turned this into a giant mob grinder. Feels built in the sky. Yeah, I don't know how to do the the automated stuff. I guess we're just making this like a Thunderdome. You can't do it when they're like this though, like on the ground. The uh, mob grinder. I'm definitely not redoing this though. <laughs> There's no way. We're close to being done, kinda. Too close the mobs will spawn under it in caves. Oh, I see. Imagine the only lava flows where you would walk and it's all made of glass. Oh, that sounds kind of cool. Yeah, my sword is going to do the grinding. <laughs> this is just going to be our thunder dome. If you build them in the sky so far away, the only things can spawn above you in the mob grinder. Ah. I guess that makes sense, yeah. Cause stuff was going to spawn underneath here. Well, luckily there's a little bit of water underneath us. Our first victim. In the Thunderdome. Okay, let's finish this one out. So we know where to end over here. Just manipulating where the mob spawn. No, that makes sense though. That makes sense. Yeah, let's complete this. Connect it. Yeah, this is so much slower. If we just did it this way the whole time. See the creepers. Please don't ruin this. We'll put torches on a little bit of the ground under it to minimize. Oh, that's a good idea too. Yeah, put the spawn th uh, the torches underneath, so we don't get any spawns that way. That's a good idea too. Trying to sound hard. There will be so many mobs that spawn in there anyway. Yeah, this area is going to be huge. It'll definitely be good with the mobs. I see some creepers already. Is that it? We're almost there. Almost. One more. Please. Yes! Okay. So we have all that left. <laughs> Boom time. Mm, I'm not playing around with these guys. Mm -mm. I love that fire aspect. That's so nice. Alright, we're almost done with the floor. <laughs> the walls will be easy.
Oh wow, we're almost out again. Got the platinum trophy on this on PSN. What do you have to do to get the platinum trophy? Ceiling is easy if you only make it five high. Is five high good enough? No. Yeah, I'm not sure if that's, is that high enough? If you do it five high, anything can spawn in three high. Okay, so maybe we will just go up that high then. Stupid stuff like snipe a skeleton, defeat the ender dragon. Ah, okay. So sniping a skeleton, you probably have to do it like super far away then with an arrow. That sounds like a fun achievement. I know there's something you do. It's like you have the skeleton archer attack a zombie. And then I think that drops a music disc or something. I haven't gotten it to drop yet though. There's one where you take fall damage while riding a pig. <laughs> that is a pretty random achievement. <laughs> yeah, it is pretty tough. Trying to get that lined up. Okay, before I forget, we're going to do a boat chest. I'm going to make this a lot easier. Oh, it's the skeleton with the creeper. Okay, I thought it was the zombie. Could have lined the skeleton and the creeper sucks. Yeah, okay. So that's why I didn't drop. I think I did it with a zombie, and that's why. No wonder. But yeah, we still don't have the music player. We still need to get that. Alright, gunpowder. Where's the gunpowder? I think we put it in there. Do we have enough wood for a chest? Uh... Yes. Okay. Yeah, I think it is the creeper. Alright. We got that. Let's just grab all of this cobblestone. Save the regular stone, because we need that for decorating. Why do I have that? It's only five of those blocks. Okay. This is part of it. Why is this one? Mm. Alright. It's a boat. It's a chest. It's going to be a boat chest. Hold on. There we go. Boat chest. Yeah, this will save us an extra trip. A wild moxie has appeared. Oh, shoot. Yeah, what's up, moxie? <laughs> Poke catch. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> when I started it up on my game, dropped like two frames a second. Oh, we made a giant bamboo farm with a flying machine that harvests it all. Oh my god, dude. Yeah, I've seen a lot of those automation things. Those things are crazy, dude. Like I was looking up earlier the um like automation for a wheat farm, and even that was kind of intense. Okay, not gravel. Not too bad, man. How you doing? Doing great, man. We are working on our first, like, big project, I guess. Which is... A Thunderdome, essentially. We got our elevators. The elevators are nice. They turned out okay. I wish this was faster, though. No distractions. We must have the pig. Into the pit. Okay, I'm gonna hold on to that. Okay, we have a few more slots available. I had a minecart hopper underneath that collected it all. Then it dumped into the water that streams. That 
fed it into more hoppers that use the fuel to cook my potatoes. Oh my god. That sounds like super intricate. I wish I was like better at the redstone stuff. I really need to like look into it more. Because I know there's like so much you can do with it. Okay, I'm going to put the tough in there. It was stupid, really. That's like unlimited food though, man. That's pretty sick. Never have to worry about food. Doing room renovations, putting down new wood floor. Hope to be back tomorrow if not, I'm too tired. Oh, dude, that's sick. That's cool that you know how to do that stuff so you can do it yourself. Oh, snap, we got rain. But it was infinite fuel supply. <laughs> yeah, if I were to automate something, I guess it would be the wheat farm, if anything. We're keeping it analog on this run. Yeah. I would love to do that. I don't know, man. If I can look up, like, the minecart thing, make something simple. But I don't know. I'm just happy I have, like, villagers near my base now. But yeah, honestly, I just want to, like, fight the dragon. I've never gotten that far in this game. I actually want to, like, see the end credits, you know? Mina Pal had an auto item sorting machine. Dang, auto sorting? I didn't even know that existed. You just dumped everything and it just sorted right in the right chest. That sounds pretty handy. Don't break the boat now. Oh yeah, true. Gotta be careful. Let's try to get it as close as we can. I guess right here. It's a boat. It's a chest. It's a boat chest. Okay, we just have to remember that's right there. There's our wall. Okay, it's not too far. People don't realize how involved this game can be. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Zerd was saying earlier that someone made like a computer in this game too. Support frog! Okay. Here we go. Can make calcul- oh yeah, calculators too. I think I saw that as well. It's crazy how they figured all that out, like the redstone. It's so cool that a game lets you do that though. Like you can do so much in this game. I've like barely scratched the surface. I guess the coolest thing I've done is just the powered rails. <laughs> That's super simple though. I do want to make that launching one though. Like launch a powered rail in a minecart into like the ocean or something. Or maybe like have it land into like a spot of water. Something random like that. Like one square of water. We'll just land in it. It's kind of just basic electronics. If you have knowledge of circuitry, you can make those things. Yeah, I do not. <laughs> I took one um, intro to electronics class, but that was about it. Charge the laser and fire the cart. Yeah, that sounds fun. I wonder how tall we're going to make it, though. I'm really curious to see how that looks like. Just like flying a minecart into the air. Oh, dude, we're so close. these bad boys on too. I'm a mechanic, as most would say, but my certificates say light motor vehicle technician. <laughs> That's sick to have all that like knowledge though. Like a lot of it can like ap apply to like real life stuff. Whole career has pretty much been a lot of auto electronics. The most I've done with that is like sound system. Like the um Replacing stock speakers and um, 
having subwoofers. Got the amp. Got two 12s. I used to have that. <laughs> Mommy code. What is that from? That was so random when you sent that before. Could wire it up but not set it up. The late 90s, early 2Ks. <laughs> Ghetto thumpers. It was my first car that I ever had. It was a 94 Saturn. And I had two 12s in there. And then I replaced the stock speakers with kickers. It was pretty fun. Such a cool car. It was just so funny to see like this old plastic looking car. Like bumping music. Hopeless when it comes to audio settings. Yeah, it definitely takes a lot of tweaking. Gotta let you set the bass in treble. I guess you just gotta like mess around with it till it sounds right. Whatever sounds good to you. And you probably have to like adjust it for every different type of music too, like rap versus metal would have a different settings. Cause there's a lot of distortion in metal. But I'm not really a sound engineer either, I just mess around with it. Yo, we're almost to the other side. Oh, dude, we're so close. So close. <laughs> I keep doing that. Man. And if it's a good stereo, you can have a dozen or so preset tweak settings. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, the presets were nice, I remember. I never messed around with them, though, but I remember the presets. Like, I think I just had the default ones set. Oh, look at that. Some of this is already done for us. Yeah, there you go. Map's gonna have a giant gray square. True. I haven't mapped out this area yet, I don't think. But that's a good point. <laughs> There's gonna be, like, this random big square. Green love time for you, Moxie. I'll be partaking later. Not yet. Artisifer. Put grass on the roof. Oh yeah, I could do that. So when we do map it out eventually, it's like, oh, it's just like a big plot of land. Urzel. Urza? Wait, what's Urza? music so much. Give it to me. Play it all night. Not of the Urzatron? No, I've never heard of that. What is it? Yeah, we're gonna have a hidden coliseum going. We're gonna be gladiators. Dude, I can't wait. I'm just gonna like tear stuff up in here. Magic the Gathering core mechanic. Oh, dude, yeah, I never played Magic the Gathering, dude. I played Yu-Gi-Oh, I guess. Not much, but I played some. Yeah, I never played it. My friend groups were in um, Yu-Gi-Oh and Pokemon cards. We didn't like battle Pokemon though. We just collected it, I guess. I always thought magic was cool though. I loved the art on the cards. Like that's like like one of my favorite things about like card games like that is the art on them. Really cool. Madness, you're the demographic I just assumed. Yeah. I probably would have played, but I think I just spent too much on Yu-Gi-Oh and Pokemon cards. It was awesome till they made the stupid cards that had stupid abilities. Yeah, I kind of fell off it after a while. But it was cool when it was, like, still new, I guess. 
I know they had like weird fusions or something eventually. I don't know. I didn't play in that era though. I played probably like what the first two seasons or something. And I was like, okay, I'm done. I had my fun. They were all expensive habits. Had to make your choice. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> it really was like one or the other almost. Because, yeah, I know there's some like really expensive magic cards too. Like, I know Black Lotus was one of them. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to put torches underneath this too. We'll get to it. Mm-mm-mm. Such a satisfying sound. Doing that little jump shot. Oh, dude, yes, this is great. Look at this, we have all of this. This is gonna help a lot. Stop. We can fill these in so easily. What's the most efficient way? Like that? I wanna back into the water, though. always wanted to try D&D. Yeah! I never had, like, a group to do D&D with, but it always sounded fun. It's like one of those, like, use your imagination, mostly. It's really cool. Oh, yes. Look at that speed. If my stepdad hadn't burned my original collection... Could have bought several houses with it by the time I graduated high school. Oh my god, he burned them. Oh, dude, that's a bummer. I used to have a holographic, like, I don't know if it was first edition, but I had one of those Charizard cards. One of, like, the first ones. I remember getting it from a booster pack, too. Oh, I was so hyped for that. Convinced my brother-in-law to be a dungeon master. Yo, if you can get a good group going, it's definitely worth a shot. He was Christian like that? Oh, dude, that sucks. Like, bro, they're just cards. Why are you gonna burn them? They're not, like, demonic or anything. Had Venusaur, had Blastoise, Hollow. No idea what happened to them. I had a Venusaur, too, that was Hollow, but... I know someone stole it. I don't know who, though. My Charizard was stolen, too. <laughs> that one was, like, hanging up on my wall, too. I had it in, like, a glass frame and everything. Yeah. Really a bummer. Like, all my good cards got stolen. <laughs> to be fair, back in the days, literally had the card Demonic Tutor. Okay, yeah, that would be a little sus for him then, I think. <laughs> like, you're saying it's not demonic or satanic, but this name says otherwise. Explain. Uh, well, you see... No, I don't know. <laughs> it's not demonic. Just a magic card. Have an ultra rare alter alternate Mew from a recent box worth around 100? Oh, dude, that's sick. I have some Mew cards, too. Um, I don't know if you remember when the first Pokemon movie came out and you went to theaters, they gave you those Mew cards. I have, like, nine of those. I don't know if they're, like, worth anything, though. I haven't checked, like, any of my cards. I know you can, like, check them on eBay and stuff, though. Well, if I play two black mana... <laughs> yeah, that even sounds, like, kind of satanic, too. Black mana? What are you talking about? During lockdown, I was buying and selling booster bonuses. Oh, dude, yeah. That sounds like a good strategy. You just have to get lucky on the, um, on the polls, right? Gotta hope you get something good. I remember someone saying that you could, like, weigh the packs and if they weigh more there's like a hollow in it something like that but i guess if you're ordering online you can't really do that 
had a business tax reference. Oh, the old ones are like that. Okay. Yeah, I remember that being a thing. Oh, the new boxes, they fixed it all? Ah, oh, dude, dang. They caught on. I guess it makes sense, though, because you would just, like, buy the heavier packs then, if that was the case. That's sopped from sword and shield boxes. Oh, okay. So that went on for a while then. Huh? Oh, I see. Oh, dude. Oh, I want this guy. He's going to drop a trident, right? Or he can drop one. Come here. Come here. Dude, stop. Please? Please? No, he didn't drop it. He dropped something, though. What is that? Oh. No luck. He can drop a shell, too. What does the shell do? I've seen the trident in action before. The trident looks really fun. Because you can, like, swim super fast and stuff. Come on, shoot! Heart of the ocean thing? Okay. Yeah, I don't really see those guys too often. Definitely had to attack that guy. <laughs> We're almost done. We're almost done with the floor. Oh my god, finally. Hold on. Yes! Yes! Okay, let's go get our chest. Our boat chest. Oh wait, no, we're not done yet. We still have this. <laughs> we're almost there. Just this little section. With the heart of the ocean, you can make an underwater shrine type thing. In a square sort of shape. It means you can breathe underwater? I would love that. Because then you could check out that underwater temple then, huh? Because I have found an underwater temple, but it's like being guarded by like the fish. And they make it so you can't mine. I think they do damage too, I can't remember. But yeah, there's like fish guarding the temple and there's a ton of them. Have to make it out of prismatic blocks, remember right? They only work at for a certain distance. Ah, okay. We'll have to look that up when we eventually get to um, exploring the underwater temples and stuff. Because I have the coordinates saved. I know where it is. I just... We're not ready for it yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Best way to get heart of the ocean is pirate treasure. Oh, yeah, I found some maps before, too. Wait, you know what? I think I might... Do I have one? I might have one. I have, like, a blue jewel. And it has yellow text when you highlight it. I don't know if that's the thing, though. That might be it. Oh, it's water. It's a boat. It's a chest. It's a boat chest. Yeah, I don't know if I've gotten one or not. I might have one, though. Because it's like a sphere. Yeah, we can check. As soon as we get done with all this stone and stuff. Yeah, so maybe we'll just make this three tall. Are we at the edge yet? Ha, 
has to be four tall. Oh, okay. So we need one more. Oh, dang it. Okay, well, the last block will be easier. Oh, okay. It has to be three tall to be two tall on the inside. Okay. So then we'll be okay then, right? Yeah, I think we'll be good. Wait. No, I kind of want it to be three tall so we can jump. And also, we need it taller for, um... Yeah, Enderman. I was just gonna say that. Yeah. So we need it one more higher. That's okay. Oh, that's easier. Why was I not doing that before? I could just hold it. Is that faster, though? Doing that? I don't know if that's faster or not. I can't tell. I think it is, like, slightly. Oh my god, look at that. <laughs> oh, this is so ridiculous. Just checked. Heart of the Sea can only be attained by a pirate treasure. I think I might have it. It's like light blue, right? And it's a sphere. Because I have found like a few um, like pirate ships. Okay, so maybe I do have it then. Yeah, I was like wondering what it's for. I just saved it though. And you need eight Nautilus shells? Okay, I don't have that. <laughs> oh, so those Nautilus shells, those are what those, um, the guys that throw the spears, they drop those? Where'd those holes come from? Did I not fill those in? I just didn't realize? That's weird. We'll come back to there and fill them in. are from drowned or fishing okay oh that's what they're called they're called drowned yeah so we should try to get luck of the sea too on a fishing rod then that'd be good to have <gasps> yes oh they don't have to be the trident ones okay but it's still like they're essentially just water zombies right so how are we going to do this? It's only a 3 to 8% chance. Oh my god, that's so low. Okay, maybe I should do this first. Well, you know what? We can do this now. Just be careful. Straight line. Drowned or zombies that fell in water. If you push on it, it'll change into... Oh, okay. I didn't know you can change them. That's good to know. So if we had, like, zombies spawn in here for whatever reason, or, like, on top of the roof, if we push them in the water, they'll turn. That's good to know. Wait, what? Did I mess it up? This is right, right? Three high? No ceiling yet? Wait, why not? Should I make it taller? Oh, gotta put torches below first. Then have torches to put on top as you make it. Oh, like on the sea. Okay, on the roof. Okay. We might have to go back for some torches then. I only have 13 on me. Oh, 
Oh, I see some spaces here. Okay. Look how dark this is. Could always make a ladder to the roof. Oh, yeah, there's, yeah, there's a lot of coal here, too. True. That should be illuminated enough, right? Except maybe this part. Yeah, let me grab this. I always overdo it, to be honest. Yeah, might as well. Okay, that just gave us 15 coal. We got some right here, too. And now we need wood. We need sticks. Oh my god, the trees are all the way over there. Come on, man. Why are they so far away? Spiders can spawn one block height. Wait, I've got sheep too, yeah. Will the spiders spawn in the dark in the um the light? Oh, they will? Oh, dude, that kind of sucks. Should I just... Mm, I don't know if I should just fill it in, then. They just won't be aggressive until dark. Oh, okay. Why do I have these? Get away. get the birch but if they are below you can avoid fighting them unless you need their loot yeah I don't really need their loot honestly I just don't know if they're gonna like spawn and prevent other things from spawning I hope that's not the case like if there's like a limit to the spawns because they're underneath okay that should be all right oh that's true it's a big area Oh, it'll be minimal? Alright. Alright, not a worry then. Yeah, we got a sapling. We can bring it over here. Oh my god, I'm so slow. Decided on big for a reason. Yeah, true. Very true. This is gonna be like a Thunderdome. Where's it at? Oh, right there. Got it. Got it. I want to plant this over here. Right there. We're talking about one specific corner. Yeah, we should be good. Okay. All right. Let's turn these into planks. Here we go. Oh, we don't need a little crafting thing anyway. Okay. Sticks. Oh, yeah, we've got a ton of sticks. There we go. So many torches. Can you put torches underwater? You can, but they go away. Okay. <laughs> I know it doesn't make sense, but I had to try. It's like, yeah, it's fire. It's going to go out. I know. I know. <laughs> I still had to see for myself. I can't really reach over there. Need like glowstone blocks or those plants that glow underwater. Oh yeah, that's a good point. We do have some glowstone. I think this is pretty decent though for now. Pretty well lit. Okay, now we can do the ceiling. So we should be doing this as we're building the uh, ceiling then. 
Okay. But again, the water will be minimal effect. Yeah, because not much can spawn in the water. It's just like the drowned guys, huh? I think that works. Or creepers will cause an issue. Yeah, I don't want to deal with creepers. Drowned in fish. Ah. I guess that's not too bad, though. I don't mind the drown spawning, because I want a chance at like getting the trident. are affected by any sort of mob or animal. Oh, shoot. It should be minimal, though, right? For, like, fish? Because I know there's a lot of fish. I just want to have, like, a, a good amount of spawns inside here that we can go after. Especially, like, Enderman. Oh my god, I'm messing this up. remember the exact numbers. If it gets too fishy, fuck them up. Yeah, we can just go in there, fight them. Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Welcome to the Thunderdome. Oh, that's gonna bother me. <laughs> it's off by one. There we go. Oh! They're already spawning. Look at that. Are you attacking me? Plus render distance dependent too? Oh yeah, that's a good point. Bro. Stop. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, because there's so many mobs within a certain area. Yeah. Alright, that's a good start. Look at all these archers, man. We're getting there. I should go back to the boat really quick. If you make a farm big enough, eventually it won't spawn any mobs or animals around it. Oh, because they'd all be inside, huh? Yeah, it's already filling up. <laughs> okay, false alarm. that in there, put those in there. Okay, that's fine. You, demon. Ah, whiffed. Come on, take that fire damage. Well, it's not enough. There we go. Had it where I couldn't get any more animals in my farm because I had so many chickens, sheep, and cows. Dude, that's where I'm at right now. I have like this small enclosure, and whenever I go to feed the chickens, they end up just like killing each other because they just they just swarm on top of each other. They can't do anything. Like a cow got in too, and there's so many chickens, they just killed the cow. Oh god, there's creepers in here. Yeah, I gotta space them out. That's another project to do. Look at this guy. He can't get me. Oh, that's a good idea. Put the hoppers underneath them. Because if you kill them outside, their stuff will drop underneath, right? So you don't have to go in the pen. Hmm. Might have to try that too. I've never really used the hoppers too much. If you leave them alone, they hatch eggs. They go into the hopper, then into chests you link them to. 
Oh, dude. So it's like self-sustaining chickens. They'll just keep like doing eggs over and over. Hoppers are life. Yeah, I gotta start using hoppers, man. That sounds very convenient. Never-ending supply of eggs. I love it. Oh, it's getting dark in here. One of the first little farms I make. Look at all these guys. They smell blood. <laughs> Sorry, guys. My work is not yet complete. Love that your plan is coming together. You can see it working. Yeah, dude. They're all just spawning in here now. It's great. I love how flat it is, too. Okay, maybe I'll start putting torches here again, too. Line these up. There we go. I'm tempted to go in there and just fight for a little bit. Maybe when I run out of blocks. Good, good. <laughs> Feel the hate flow through you. You already have the chickens, but you would throw the eggs and sometimes you get more chickens. Yeah, I ended up getting like so many chicken eggs, dude. I threw them in the nether. <laughs> so I just had like had some chickens roaming around the nether. It's like a home away from home. I got something to remi remind me of my farm. <laughs> make cake. Oh yeah, I forgot that's a thing. You can make cake. Oh, d my torches, duh. Hold on, let's fix this. Right here. The sun is coming up. They're still alive, though. Come on, guys. Just stay in the dark. You're safe there. For now. Do that. Wait, it's off center. There we go. And the zombies and the skellies will hide in the dark areas. Yeah, I need them to stand over there. Hey. Now oh, they smell me. Killing me is more important than staying alive, apparently. It's 1 a.m. here. Better go to sleep. Gotta be up at work at five and a half hours. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> Alright, Craig. Get some sleep, dude. Thanks for uh, stopping by. Thanks for chatting with me for a bit, dude. I will see you around. Shoot the creeper? Yeah, might as well. He disappeared. Vanished without a trace. Oh, he's right here. Hey. Oh, look at that dodge. <laughs> Got him. Let's go look. Oh, we've got one hiding. There's still too much light, I think. Yeah. This is going to be great, though. <laughs> yeah, clever girl. Clever. Let's do another one right here. There we go. Actually, we might have to go mine just more cobblestone, too. It kind of feels that way. Oh, dude. I need to stop doing this. Just leave them. Leave them. I'll fix it later. Let's 
strip the land bare. The pit is all that matters. True. Enter the pit. The pit of despair. Oh yeah, I could use dirt. That's a good point. Let's grab some dirt from the outside. So close, dude. We're so close. I want to do torches here now, too. Every little, but like six that we do. Put a torch right there. Yo, stinky floorboard. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate that. We are just building a Thunderdome, I guess. <laughs> It'd be nice to have a permanent self-refilling XP farm though. Dude, yeah, I can't wait for that. This is going to make it so much easier. It's going to be fun, like, fighting everything too. I'm going to feel like an actual gladiator. Oh my god. Hey, there's a zombie. Hey, they're spawning. They are definitely spawning in here now. Not the smartest though, but you know. Wanting only to die at the moment, yeah. Such is life right now. It's the life cycle of a zombie. Oh, dude, I forgot the torches. Oh, shoot. Let's do that. And that. Oh, that's going to bother me. Even though I'm not really going to be up here, I want it to be somewhat even guess okay oh dude we're almost out no I don't know how much we have back at home I guess we're gonna find out though yeah it feels good man ah. seeing everything just come together just a massive project fine. The last two. Alright, we gotta go back to base. I'm not about to use wood. Nah. I don't want to use wood for this. To see how much we have left. Does boat not have any more? No, dude. I cleaned it out. It's all gone. <laughs> we should have a good amount still at home. I'm hoping. Well, we're about to find out. I see it. Home sweet home. Such a long journey. I wish this had a motor on it. Like a motorboat. Four day mega project. Poor structural integrity. Pit of death. Nearly completed. <laughs> yeah, boats. Yeah, definitely feels slow. I wish there was like a faster way to get over there. Uh, 
Eventually, I want to make this look nicer, too. I don't know what to do with it, though. But it's kind of like a little cave entrance right here. You got your boat. Then you have elevator. Going up. Okay. Gleaming blocks of gold. Maybe eventually. Once we have, like, a lot of gold. Okay, let's take from... Oh, my God. We're almost cleared out. Yikes. Okay. Cobblestone. Oh, jeez. I hope this is enough. Definitely not using gravel. I don't want to use the regular stone either. Let's put the wood in here. We're not using netherrack. No, not stone. Blackstone, basalt. Okay. We still have some we have some junk on us. Let's put this stuff away. Eggs, bones, gunpowder, string goes in here. Extra boots for some reason. Rotten flesh. Copper ingot. Okay. We don't need to carry this hoe with us, honestly. Keep the sticks for coal later on. I am in an SMP where people just put bases in random areas and then abandon them. So I sometimes end up coming across the builds near villages. I have yet to play on like a, a server like that before. It sounds fun though. I don't know if I want to use the dirt. I mean, it's there. Basalt. Oh, dude, no. That's basically everything, guys. Tough. Andesite. I don't want to use the stone. There's a white wool. Oh, no. Well, if it comes down to it, we can always, like, dig over there. Dirt. Oh, yeah, I guess. I guess we'll get the dirt. Let's put this stuff in the boat chest first, though. Most villages in a 5,000 by 5,000 block radius of spawn have been encountered. So does that mess up your um, playthrough, then? If they've already encountered the villages? I'm not too sure how that works. Like, do you want to, like, discover the villages yourself? Oh, okay. Oh, that's a bummer. Then people just, like, stop playing. Aw. Trying to find the village, and there's no villagers to trade with. Oh! Because sometimes they get under attack, right? Is that what happens? Like, they won't be attacked if you don't discover them? Oh my god, I can't believe we cleared all this out. Oh, we did have sand. I just didn't see it. Gravel or some calcite. People killed a lot of the villagers during an event. Who can kill the most villagers? Oh, dude, that sucks. Why would you do that? Alright, guys, that's everything. Make it... Oh, you... Yeah, that's a good point. Might as well. We have these two. Let's make a few more. We've got the room. We got the sticks. Let's make two more. There we go. Alright, that's everything. We've got no more building blocks. The most person killed nearly 3k villagers, mainly by bleeding them in bases. Oh, breeding them in bases. I guess that's... That makes sense. How you'd like be able to kill 3k, you just keep breeding them, killing them over and over. That's a weird competition, though. Whoever can kill the most villagers. I told you you'd say you need more cobblestone. True, you did. I didn't think I'd need this much. I thought we had enough. Little did I know. We need way more than that. <laughs> Math, bro. True, true. 
What was that? That was weird. Then after that was the most dead bushes broken? What's a dead bush? <laughs> no distractions. <laughs> They're trying to trying to mess me up. Whatever's in the water is trying to mess me up right now. I see it. I see the torches. It's dead bushes in the mesa and desert biomes. Oh, like the brown bush. Okay, I got you. That's a weird competition too. Just breaking the bushes. That's so random. Look at that, we have a welcoming party here. Oh, I should withdraw all this. Whatever we can. Okay. Whoa, you guys. Whoa, chill, chill, chill. There's enough of me to go around. Go away. Okay. You too. Jeez. The number one person broke 22,000 dead bushes and ended up winning $10 by the owner. Oh my god. All that work for $10. Yeah, fight your way to the fighting pit. Is anyone in here? Oh, it's getting dark. Look at that. If I broke this, it'd probably be darker. Yeah. Obviously, but... <laughs> within a week oh my god I wonder how many hours that took that's ridiculous though I, I guess we'll use the dirt first no <laughs> why not like this let me get the shovel out too because we're gonna need this oh I should have made another shovel Okay, we're going to have to be careful with the dirt then. Where is my inventory space? Why can't I hold everything? Oh, that's why. Eventually, you want to make the door out of dirt or sand. I have two iron shovels? Oh, I do. You're right. Okay, never mind. We're good. We're good. Didn't even see that. Wait, why do I want to make the door out of dirt or sand? The biggest collection of bases is around 7,000 blocks away from spawn. That sounds kind of fun, though. Like having a city, basically. Because light passes through actual doors. Oh, okay. That makes sense. I didn't think of that. Yeah, we want this to be, like, pitch black. I see a bunch of spiders are spawning. Okay, I can hold that block finally. Okay, let's get this torch situation going, too. can't wait till this is done <laughs> uh, so much dude I've never done something like this before most bases are around the SMP landmark called the barrier church as well as the library and housing areas I would love to have like a server one day I feel like that'd be so cool then you can actually like build villages build cities but I feel like you need someone to, like, moderate it so people don't, like, break other people's stuff. Yeah. Too much for right now, though. It is a thing of beauty. <laughs> Beauty's in the eye of the beholder. This looks so... so scuffed. All different kinds of blocks. But you know what? It serves a purpose. As long as it does, it serves its purpose, that's all that matters. Who cares how it looks? OK, 
Okay, I'm gonna look behind me after this, see how much more we have. All right, there goes the dirt. You can break dirt mistakes with a dirt block. Don't switch it. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. What about the speed, though? Isn't it faster with the shovel? Oh, my God. Well, we're about halfway, right? Close to halfway. Yo, we are making progress. By three tenths of a second. Okay, so it's not that much of a difference. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, these... Dude, I haven't seen these in, like, a while. Go away. Go away. I don't want any trouble. Go away. Of course they come out right when I'm, like, building stuff. It's so creepy. There's an Enderman. I'm gonna make eye contact. He's gonna be pissed. Yeah, I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you, bro. Come here. Come here. So you're not gonna come over here? Can he not climb? He's gonna steal a torch. Bro, you better not. Oh my god, there he is. <laughs> Teleports behind me. Nothing personal, kid. Where... Dude. Oh, he broke my shield. Hell no. I need another shield. Hey, I got a um, ender pearl, though. Hell yeah. I didn't realize my shield was about to break. Oh well. Here comes the sun. Yeah, another one, dude. I feel like we're getting pretty lucky with the drops. I thought I saw a creeper. There's one. Yeah, very lucky all day, for sure. We got a bunch of those blaze rods, too. Got a ton of diamonds. All that horse armor. Well, that's not really that lucky. Because we only have one horse. But we have horse armor. So close. Okay, put a torch here. Sounds like a baby zombie. Been neglecting my idle game? Oh no! What game is it? Dude, some of those idle games are really fun. There was one RPG idle game I used to play, like, way back in the day. I forget what it was called, but you had, like, a party of three characters, and they would just, like, farm, like, AFK farm. Oh, that game was so fun. It was like an MMO. It's called Firestone, the one I'm playing? Oh, okay. I've never heard of that one. Firestone. I'll have to check that out. Okay, we're getting close here. It's pretty sweet if you decide to try them on server 8. Okay. 
I'll look that up after stream. Firestone. Let me let me write that down so I don't forget. Firestone server eight. Got it. Oh, <laughs> a creeper right there. He almost got me. Okay, let's do this. Close enough. No, it's going to bother me. Close enough. <laughs> At least I think I am. Gotta look it up. No worries. Oh shoot, oh, okay, I thought I dropped it. I don't think we have enough to complete it, but we won't need to mine too much, I don't think. Hopefully not. Also, you know what, I'm gonna switch pickaxes. Cause I don't wanna keep using this diamond one. Okay, let's swap to that. Oh, server S8, okay. Good to know. Yeah, I'll definitely check that out. Some of those idle games are really fun. Is it like a cookie clicker idle game? Yeah, almost there, dude, so close. Because one of the cookie clicker idle games I played before was called Adventure Capitalist. That was a really fun one. I think I'm going to do the torches after. Make it faster. Like you have a team and they do battle on stages then when you can get into a higher stage you prestige and start over stage one keep all your precious fire stones oh that kind of sounds like soda dungeon almost that was another idle game too that was a lot of fun yeah those are like i like those games a lot really addicting More file stones equals more gold. More gold equals more bonuses purchased. Okay. Yeah, Soda Dungeon had a similar system to that. You kind of like do a new game. Yeah, it's snowballs. I love the snowball. Oh, dude, this stuff actually looks nice. Oh, shoot. What is this? Calcite. We gotta find more of this stuff. I feel like this would be like a good like floor block, maybe. It looks really cool. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, where should we mine cobblestone? And the scales, too. Can be just as idle, as constant, as busy as you're willing to have it. Yeah, I like that too. Like, if you play it, you'll actually go faster. But you can always just stay idle. Why are they all creepers? I 
feel like we should mine cobblestone in the mountain somewhere. Instead of being out here. Because we have a bunch of gravel here. Hmm. Daytime leans creepers. That's why you see so many in caves. Oh. Did not know that. Okay, actually this is pretty deep. Ah, <sighs> so it begins. Oh, this is gonna suck. We can make it like a path. So I feel somewhat productive. Okay, I'll leave it like that. Here's like a little path to our, our little pit, you know? Gladiator pit. Did you ever think you'd be mining to get cobble? No, never. Never thought I'd do something like this. I thought we would always just have like too much cobblestone and not have any idea what to do with it. Think of all the cobble you left in the mines, true. So much cobble in there. To rot. <laughs> this is your penance. <laughs> Forgive me. I have sinned. I left so much cobble. And now I must mine the cobble that I have forsaken. Oh, forgive me. <laughs> no, I don't even want to touch this copper. Don't need it. Don't want it. Get it out of my sight. It will be built of misery and penance. <laughs> All my blood, sweat, and tears. All for what? I guess this works. This makes it a little bit easier. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. <laughs> All this manual labor right now. No, get it away. Don't need copper. Don't want copper. Wait, actually, no, 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 not right now. We can get it later if we want it. Because I do like the copper floor. You're mining cobble to turn it into XP though, so cobble the new redstone. True. I mean, we are going to get a lot, a lot of XP from this. Eventually. I don't know how much we need. What are we at? Oh god. <laughs> Not nearly enough. Stone, you're born of this. Molded by it. No one cared who I was until I equipped the pickaxe. After this row right here, these two rows, I'm going to check. We'll place them down. I need to break up the monotony. Okay. Let's go. Look at that. So illuminated. Look at that. Literally mining. Leveling the resources behind instead of going for them. 
I just need the cobblestone right now, man. Uh oh, we got archers. They're gonna mess us up. Oh. Is he riding the spider? Oh, hell no. He's got a spider mount. Spider rider. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna mess with that guy. Can you not? Oh, dude, I don't have a shield. That sucks. Yeah, can you not? You just, like, say you did, but not. Oh, my God. I'm failing at this. Okay, here we go. Oh, my God, no! No! No, 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 no. <laughs> uh, that's bad. I need a shield, dude. I need a shield so bad. <laughs> yeah, that that could have been terrible. Could you imagine dying in there? Couldn't be me. Oh <laughs> yeah. Have at thee. On guard. Wait, what? He like ricocheted off my armor. And it hit him. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, dude, stop. Stop. I don't want any trouble now. Don't want any trouble. If only you had a bed and no monsters nearby. <laughs> True. It's okay. The sun will rise. And a new day will dawn. Oh, door. Don't hold the door. <laughs> oh, door. Oh, door. Please don't shoot me. Please don't shoot me. Come on. I'm just placing torches, guys. Don't mean any harm here. Okay, I think we're good. There's no archers behind us now. Oh, jeez. That was intense. No! Why did I do that? God dang it. <laughs> uh, why? No, 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 no. Oh my god, there's so many. Oh, no, 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 no. Hell no. We're not dying. Not like this. Oh my god. Could you guys not be chasing me? Yo, this is gonna be an intense little, like, gladiator area. All these guys? Oh my god. Close the door. I need to. Well, I'm gonna get stuck if I fall in, though. Oh my god. Go away. We're not interested. I'm happy with my service provider. Oh my god. These smaller ones are so hard to hit, too. It's like gnomes in World of Warcraft. <sighs> okay. Oh, that's a good point. I should close it off right here. Mm mm. Nope. Oh my god. Yeah, that was pretty good XP. Jeez, that was ridiculous. I really need a shield, though. Forgot to make that when we were back at base. So some insight into exactly what this is will be when it's done. How did it feel? Uh, it was painful, dude. Not even done yet, and I'm feeling it. Uh. It'll be nice once we're like farming XP, though. That's for sure. You know what? I don't. I don't care if these are even anymore. I'm done. 
<laughs> yeah, I know. Ceiling torches. They don't have to be even anymore. I'm done trying to be a perfectionist with them. No. Just enough to have light. That's all we need. Yeah, I'll never see the roof again. Good point. Do you stop moaning? Freaking me out. so close. I hate it. Oh, thankfully, we got some peaceful music, though. About five more stacks of stone, maybe seven. We're getting there, man. Oh, no. You want to go? Death from above. <laughs> Berserker charge. Alright, it's daytime. We're a little bit safer now. I'll see like the coal and the copper just sitting out over there. Uh, yeah. Skipped over that for sure. Alright, we almost got one stack. Oh, this is a good strat. What if we do wait no no no. I shouldn't do that. What if I fall into lava? Yeah, it would suck. We should be good on the pickaxes, though. My boat chest. Worst case, you can make stone pickaxe. Yeah, that's true. I hope it doesn't come to that. I hope we just get enough from this. Please. We are at two full stacks, almost two and a half. It's a lot better doing this in the daytime, that's for sure. Don't have to watch your back at all. Yo, it would be cool if you could make like a houseboat. Just random thought. Or you could like, you have your boat, but you're like towing a platform or something. Maybe set up a pressure plate, iron door. Let there be a little safe area near the entrance. That's a good idea, yeah. Yeah, we sh definitely should make a safe area. Because we got swarmed by those little zombies, and that was kind of scary.
It's definitely going to get like intense in there. Whatcha building? I am building a Thunderdome. No, it's like essentially a, um, like a monster spawner, I guess? Like stuff is gonna spawn in there and I'm just gonna like enter like a gladiator and kill everything. And that's how we're gonna farm XP. Maybe set up some fences inside you can swing over the top of, but they can't jump over. Oh, that's a good idea too. Okay, we're at, we're almost at five stacks. We should be good soon. Let's try it with five stacks and see where that gets us. Yeah, we could do that fence thing. I feel like we should make a little safe area in there though. Like maybe have like a slot like this open, you know? But have like this and that like on top, just like one little safe spot. <laughs> There's no sport in that. <laughs> Let's see, what do we got? Okay, we should be good here. We just have to finish this roof. Oh yeah, it is dark in there. <laughs> yeah, it was kind of scary last time. When I fell in, oh my god. Okay, see we just have this much left. We're almost done with it. this is enough man I really do I just want to be done with this already Ugh. I want to farm my XP I want to kill some monsters dude oh no I don't think it's enough the uh. struggle almost taste it oh yeah roof torches yeah I'll get on that too doesn't have to be perfect okay that should be good Alright, we got two and a half stacks left. Let's see how much further this gets us. Probably probably another row. Cause it seems like we go through two stacks for every row. If a few zombies on the roof it's not the end of the world if they fall into the water yeah that's true and like Craig was saying I guess they turn into drowned zombies then so that would be cool too if we can get like the spear from them or I mean trident yeah trident but I don't yeah I don't know if they would spawn into the ones that throw those or throw the trident or is that something completely different I don't know Yeah, I've got no idea. No! Ugh. Back to the mines. Oh my god. I'm not going to use the diamond pickaxe for this. So not five, seven, or ten. Okay. Let's go for four more stacks, or let's go until this pickaxe breaks. Cause that's pretty much where we have to, well, I mean, we can make a, mm. 
I don't know what would be faster, just making stone pickaxes or going back to base and making iron ones and coming back. Probably the stone. Yeah, it's making stone. At least we're clearing this area out. So it's kind of like a nice paved walkway to the Thunderdome. Oh no, this pickaxe is about to break already. It's so fast, man. So close. Yeah, dude, I, yeah, definitely got to see it through. We've gotten this far today. We've got to complete it. We've got to finish the ceiling. I will eventually do those netherrack torches, though. That sounds so sick. Like, maybe near the entrance or something? Maybe have one on every corner, too? No! Okay, I don't have any wood. Wait, can't you make wood from this? No, you can't, okay. <sighs> I have to go all the way over here, because I don't think that tree's grown yet. Wait. Wait, no. I refuse. We're going to finish it with dirt if we have to. I don't care, man. <laughs> oh, dude, this is so much faster. We should have just done this. Yeah, dirt. Brain blast. Oh, lovely dirt. <laughs> we didn't need cobblestone. Yeah, going all out. Where are we at? Okay, we need a few more. Dead shovel in three, two, one. Yeah, dude, this is breaking so much faster. But we're getting blocks faster, too. Why do I keep hitting the grass? I don't want to hit the grass. I feel like that's taking durability, too. Like, can you not? Please. Okay, we got one, two, three, four, five. Oof. Okay, let's try it with this. Hopefully this is enough. Yeah, the dirt was so much faster. Alright, we got our cobblestone. Let's use this up first. Oh, I hear him in there. They are not happy. Oh, not these things again. I don't have a shield. Come on. Play fair. Hurry up. And night falls on the pit. Got him. Got him. Okay, now that those are out of the way, what was that? Oh, I gotta fill that in. I can almost taste it. Bro. Oh, 
level. Are we? We've got... No, we've got a lot. We still have that stack of 64. We'll be aight. I think. have to use this one now. At least until we get all this cobble figured out. Dude. Really? Why are they coming out now? They were never out before. I hate these things so much. Stop! Preventing progress. Because they sense the pit. Yeah, probably. Like, oh, are you working on a project? <laughs> That's too bad. <laughs> Come on. Come. Come. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Be a shame. Yeah, that type of situation. <laughs> Mm. Yeah, what is that? Do I have... Oh, that's what's hurting them. I have thorns. You know, I didn't know that was a thing in this game. It's like Diablo 2, bro. I've got a thorns aura. Back to dirt. I think we're gonna need more. Unfortunately. Okay. Dude. Really? Okay, they're like trying to hit me in the pit now, too. Like, right when I get to the edge, they're like attacking. Always need more Chinese mega project. Hey. Where's your buddy? Huh? Where's your buddy? Yeah. Thought. Can I shoot him in the air? No. <laughs> I'm not gonna try. You better not knock me off, dude. Oh my god. I need more. More dirt. Oh, now he comes out. Oh, both of them. And a creeper. Surprise creeper. Get away. Get away. Oh, dude, there's so many creepers. Get back! Get back, fiend! Demon! I see you. I see you. Okay. Please, just leave me alone. Let me finish this, man. scared me. <laughs> I feel like I should dig this stuff out first without the grass. Oh, I hope 
hope I don't fall into a hole. Alright, we're going until the shovel breaks. Should we get? We got two stacks plus some change. That is not enough to complete it though. Okay, let's go grab some wood. Don't want any trouble, guys. I'm just working here. I don't even see that tree where we planted. Never enough. Not enough, never enough, for real. Wait, what is that? Like an underwater cave over there, almost. Or an above water. Slightly underwater. Alright, let's cut down some trees. <laughs> no distractions. I'm so easily distracted. This spyglass, dude. It's both a blessing and a curse. It's like, ooh, what is that over there? Oh, look at that. Okay, that should be enough. Come on, swim, swim. Look at that. Expert jumps right there. Okay, there it is. <laughs> it's a random trench right here. Oh, there's the tree. It's just deciding not to grow for whatever reason. Okay, that's fine. Anyway, now we have this. We got our... Oh, wait, no, 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 no. We have to make that. Okay, now we can make the sticks. I'm going to put this by the door. So I feel like this is something that would be useful. Alright. <clears throat> I think I'm going to... Wise plan, yeah. Oh, I should get... S yeah, stone. Maybe I'll do a stone shovel. I'll do a few stone shovels. How about that? And then we'll do dirt. Okay, four stone shovels. Perfect. Okay, now we'll be good, and we can complete this finally. Famous last words. Yeah, something else is going to come up. Or a creeper's gonna like blow up something, like a huge chunk of it. Oh, I hope that doesn't happen. Found some coal. Oh yeah, fences in the gate too. Yeah, that's a good idea. You know, I think I didn't need four. Maybe I only needed one. Let's go until this one breaks and see. Yeah, I do need a safe retreat once inside for sure. Alright, let's see what we can do with this amount. I just definitely want to finish the ceiling today. Okay, let's get our torches out too. Just random blocks. 
Oh yeah, that is pretty fast. like a stone's throw away from the other side right now. Come on. Oh, it's like right there. That's like maybe two more rows. If that. Maybe a little over two. Yeah, a little over two. Please be enough. No, that's not going to be enough. Almost that. Almost. <laughs> Never enough, dude. I swear. Man, I'm curious to see how dark this place is once it's all like fully covered. I feel like it's gonna look really cool. an endless void of black. That's gonna look cool then. I'm excited. Just complete darkness. We gotta fill in those holes too. I should probably do that right now. While it's still somewhat safe. Did not see that there. Yeah. <laughs> Chill, man. All right. Yeah, we are so close. Let's go back over here, where our original trench is. So that's probably four more stacks. It's probably like 27 more stacks, oh no. No, 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 not 27. Uh, I'm not ready for that. I feel like that's a, the amount we've gotten in total for this. For just the uh, ceiling. No, way more than that. There's been so much. Forgot about the second story. Hell no. A <laughs> one and done, dude. <laughs> this is pain right now. I actually feel like I'm going crazy. Okay, do I have another? Okay, we have two more shovels. This is all we're going to need. I hope. I wish the dirt was like, no, wait, never mind, no, I don't. <laughs> I was going to say, I wish it was like gravel. No, then I couldn't use it. Oh, 
Okay, so I was thinking four more stacks, I think. Let's finish this little section, see what we have. got three and a half <laughs> is that enough I hope that's enough please have mercy Dude. Dude, six more blocks that would be the case okay let's see what are we working with here We still need more. It's always more. How does this use so much, man? This is kind of ridiculous right now. No. No! Oh my god. <laughs> this is so dumb. Stop. Dude, that would, like, knock me down into the pit. Of course that would. Oh my god, come on. <sighs> Was that one more? Oh, we still have another stack. Saved. That's not gonna be enough, though. I can already tell. Coach says it's normal to bleed from the ears. <laughs> oh, dude. All right. Last batch. For sure this time. Oh man. Better make it three stacks to be sure. Yeah, I'll probably go for three. That's a good point. Please, like no creepers spawn behind me. Just let me gather in peace. Yeah, no more silliness. Okay, there's one stack. Wait, really? Just one? I feel like I was digging so much more than that. AFK bio. Expect it done when I get back. No, this is not going to be done, dude. I'm still going to be digging. <laughs> hey, look. A little chicken came to say hello. At least we got some peaceful music. Ah, nice and soothing. Shovel's broken. 
<laughs> please be enough, please. I don't want to make another shovel. that it's like two and a half I thought I heard those little flying things I don't know what those are called they look like flying stingrays back there's no way I'm gonna be finished that fast <laughs> my shovel broke so I'm building with what we have hopefully this is enough We got two and a half stacks. So is it the seventh circle of hell? Or is building it? You're building the seventh circle of hell right now. This whole process is that. Oh my god, we're almost done. Yes, dude, yes. It's only like too long too, like too wide. It's told you to get three, yeah. I think we have enough. 58, oh my god. Maybe? Just maybe? Please? <laughs> One more run, oh, you gotta be kidding me. Stop. Dude, why can't you crouch faster? Why is this as fast as you... Oh my god. <sighs> oh yeah, roof torches too. Do that right now. I need to make another shovel, man. Yeah, I don't have another shovel. This is so scuffed. Finishing it with dirt. Oops. Oh wait, I don't have a shovel. Let's make a wooden shovel, I guess. No, I'm not gonna mine stone. Not with my hands. Wait, I have a pickaxe. Eh, whatever. Better make it two stacks, please no. Where did all these creepers come from, dude? What? No way. You've gotta be kidding me, dude. Stay over there. Oh, dude, this is terrible. This is so slow. Finishing it with the 14th century grave digger shuffles, I love it. <laughs> I have a thing for pain and punishment, apparently. It's not painful enough. I have to use wooden shovels. <laughs> oh my god, I didn't think it would be this bad. I thought it would just change like the durability. We got this though, we got this. Let's get two stacks. Alright, anticipating a creeper. No, we're still good. Dig trenches with a plate on a stick. <laughs> Please. We're almost done. Yeah, let's go. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah. I definitely had a feeling that was going to happen. Uh, let's just see 
If we can make it with what we have. <laughs> yeah, free dirt. It worked out. Yeah, that's almost two stacks. We should be good now. Hopefully. I don't want to make another trip. Please. Please. Oh my god. I cannot climb for some reason. There we go. I forgot how to jump. Here we go. I'm about to finish. dangerous yes oh my god finally oh we're finally done I gotta see what's inside now oh, I don't have a shield though yes the pit the pit is finally complete enter the pit I don't like these creepers. I'm going after this, uh, this zombie, though. Okay, well, the pit's done. I think it's because there's, like, a ton of monsters outside. Maybe that's why they're not spawning in here right now. So in the daytime, they're probably going to spawn, like, a lot. You know how to make them spawn? No, I do not. How do you make them spawn? Dude, stop. Hang out on the roof during the day and then go inside? Okay. Get over here. Dude, I'm so tired of these things. Go away. Leave me alone. <laughs> what is that? Phantom membrane. Okay, let's hang out on the roof for a second. Do, 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 do. Just chilling on the roof. Chilling, just chilling on the roof. Dead center. I can't tell. This looks close to center. And some water. Remember to hydrate. Okay, I'm going in. We do have to make like a thing in here eventually. Oh my god, that's a lot of creepers. Too soon. Why is there so many creepers, man? Enough! Well, we got some more spawning now. I wish we could make it so that it's not creepers spawning. Like, just give me skeletons and zombies. Yikes. Okay. Please don't blow up. It leans creeper during the day. Yeah. I hate it. So is it better to spawn them at night then? Because I don't want creepers in here. It's terrible. No light. No light whatsoever. Okay, and then eventually we'll make like a little, like a safe area. So build a fence and keep them too far to explode and use a bow. Yeah, it's a good idea too. Okay. I think that's going to be a project for next time though, because, oh my god. I went over two hours than I usually do on Sunday. Jeez, six hours. I get it, man. Yeah. <laughs> That was a long one, dude. 
All right, yeah, that's going to do it for me. Appreciate you hanging out so long, Zared, though. Appreciate that, man. It's good talking to you, good catching up. I'll check that game out, though, after stream. But, yeah, that's going to do it for me today, guys. Um, yeah, next stream is going to be Tuesday. We'll be back with Diablo 2, and we'll go from there. Hope you guys have a good rest of your day, rest of your night, and I'll see you next time. Take care. Peace.